Hey, I'm Randall Constant, and I'm Amazon Live at 9.15. All right, this is the second stream today. I was on a little earlier. I was on for three hours, and I did three... I did three gift cards. Yeah, I'm just kind of playing like, you know, kind of playing like I'm getting ready for Final Four, the Final Four Finals. And, you know, if you if you have, if you're watching the Final Four Finals, you're watching the final game, I guess, on Monday, and you got some visitors, you might want to cook some stuff to eat. And I figured Rosina meatballs would be a good thing. I worked with those guys for like 19 years, and it does make a pretty good snack. Yeah, there's a whole bunch of things that make great snacks, but today I'm, I'm kind of focused in on Rosina. Rosina's out of Buffalo, New York, and he makes some great stuff. In fact, I got, let's see, wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. I got the bags here. Yeah, Rosina makes, well, their, their two best-selling items are home style and Italian style. Yeah, I I like the home style, but I rather the Italian style. And they they also make Swedish. They make Angus beef. Uh, they make a they make one with bacon, you know, bacon smoky flavor. Oh, uh, they make all kinds of stuff. So anyway, I'm giving gift cards for like seven dollars and seventy seven cents, and that kind of covers the cost of buying a bag of them. Of course, you can't get you know you can't get that uh, on Amazon. You know, we don't have frozen distribution but maybe one day in the future you just never know all right so that's what the that's what the promotion is so let's see let me let me uh get over to my let me get over to amazon live see what's going on oh yeah that's true i gotta go ahead and put i gotta go ahead and put my go ahead and put something in the chat See if I get something in the chat before somebody beats me to it. I don't know. Somebody probably beat me to it. No, I guess not. Maybe not. I might have. I might. Yeah, I think I got it. All right, good. Well, at least I got. At least I got. I got six in already. That's good. Let me put this down so I don't drop this phone. I don't want to break my phone. All right, I went ahead. I'm just gonna go ahead and get started with the carousel. Hey, look, uh, look. It's nine seventeen. I might have a giveaway at uh, ten o'clock. Right at 10 o'clock, right straight up, okay? Straight up. So I, I got characters that hang out on my live streams all the time. And then I don't know who's going to do it, but somebody's going to go ahead and bring up the drawbridge and, and cut cut off the deal so that there's no extra entries. Yeah, we're going to cut it off right at the hour, right up uh, right up and down. If everything goes right, we'll do one the next hour. If everything goes right, we'll do one the next hour. So when, it, when, the, when the big hand hits the 12 up on the top, it's time to bring up. Let's try. It's time to bring up the drawbridge, and that that would be it. You can't you can't get in after that. That's it. You're it, it's 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 over. Hey, look, I know seven dollars and seventy seven cents is not exactly the biggest uh, prize that you could ever get, but hey, seven 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 dollars and seventy seven cents is better than no cents. Uh, that's for sure. Hey, look, I put the Fitbit in here. Look, I, I in fact I could. I got to cut this out. Let me move this to a different screen. Yeah, I got the Fitbit here. Yeah, way back in the day, five, you know, five years ago, I got the Fitbit Blaze. I wore this watch for three years and three months, and it worked out really good. And then when this watch came out, I, I ended up picking that, picking that one up. Tell you what, it helped me out because it gave me... You better believe it helped me out. Let's see. Look how much it helped me out. Yeah, in 2016, 2017, you know, being in the food industry is dangerous because you see food all day and then you end up eating it. So I ate too much of it in 2016 and 2017. And next thing you know, I was up to 214. Yeah, I was up to 214. I was up there. So I had to come, I had to come down. So after after 115 days of doing a lot of running and walking upstairs and eating a lot less food, um, I I documented the whole journey. And I uh, got down, got down to 163, and I uh, wrote about exactly what I did. Documented everything I ate. Documented everything I did. And when it was all said and done, Fitbit contacted me and said, "Wow, what? What did you do? What did you eat? Can we see what you ate? Can we download your information?" So anyway, it worked out pretty good. In fact, I, in fact, I wrote about it on LinkedIn. Got 65,000 views on it. Go ahead and try to get 65,000 views on LinkedIn. That ain't too easy. 
Yeah, it's the biggest, it's the it's the most, I guess, most read posts I ever did. Because it's pretty interesting because I got just because of the fact that I documented the deal. Anybody could do it. Look, Jeff's in first. Jeff's in first. Kmart Kelly. Vicky's in. All right. Uh Tink. All right. Getting getting a good start. Getting a good start. Yeah, I went ahead. I went ahead and went eat with Calvin. I didn't know what was up. I didn't know what was up, what was going on. But uh, my wife made a jambalaya, had some shrimp, had some hot sausage in there, and had some crawfish. Had crawfish, shrimp, and sausage. Can't beat that. That's exactly I mean, that's what I ate. That's what I ate. That's what my break was. Yeah, eating that. We were watching. Calvin was watching some kind of, I don't know, some kind of movie about a dog. Yeah, some dog movie. So I watched a little bit of that with him. And then I figured, well, I got to go back. I got to go back. I got to go back up and get to work. Got to get going. I got some, I got some gift cards to give away. Uh, so I figured I'd have to get, I'd have to get started. So I started at 9.15. So I was a little late. I wanted to start a little earlier, but uh, you know how it goes. And look, I stand up. Well, a while ago, I stand up here for three hours. Okay. And then later down the road, you want to sit down. <laughs> you want to sit down every once in a while. So sit down, eat, and then, uh. Well, to be honest with you, I probably would have went to sleep if I would have stayed there too long. So, got to get up before you sleep. Yeah. Uh, yeah, the deal The deal with this, look, it doesn't matter if it's this, if it's the Fitbit, if it's the Apple, if it's the Garmin, if it's the Samsung. It doesn't matter. All four of those, All four of those companies make some great watches. It's all about documenting what you do. Hey, it's just like you want a lower electric bill. Go ahead and document it. Go ahead and write. Go at twelve o'clock noon and put down your kilowatts. And then tomorrow at twelve o'clock, go ahead and see what it is and write down your kilowatts. Watch if you really work at it, you could save money on your electricity because you're going to be motivated to see. Let's see if I could burn less electricity than i did yesterday same thing with eating same thing we're talking about energy same thing yeah if you go you know if you eat pizza i like pizza pizza is what everybody likes ice cream is what everybody yeah everybody likes if you eat pizza you eat one two pizzas two pieces and you stop you're doing okay but guess what <laughs> Eating the third piece and the fourth piece is pretty good, but guess what? You got to burn all that fuel off, and that's a it's a lot of work. If you if people knew what they had to do to get rid of some of that extra that extra the extra thing that they ate, uh, they probably would put it down pretty quick. Uh, I know if I you know if I really worked hard, I probably could go back the other way. Yeah, I could go back the other way. I got to work on going back the other way sooner or later, you know. But the only thing is, I'm I'm in this, you know, I don't have no room in here. I got stuff all over the place. All over. I can't even move here. So you do a long <laughs> one thing I could one thing I could say is that look, if, if you ever get a job where you actually have to work work and walk around, never complain because when you walk it, you're that's your exercise. Yeah. If so if you work five if 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 you're a you know, if you're a waiter or a waitress. And you're doing a lot of walking and doing a lot of holding this and that, and whatever. It's like a workout. And then when you go home, you don't have to work as hard. You don't have to exercise as much because you did it at you did it at work. So it's like going out. It's it's like working out. That's what it. That's what it usually is. Yeah, it's all the usual characters hanging out. Always. That's always. That's always the case. All right. Let's see. Yeah. So the Fitbit. Yeah, the Fitbit's two and a quarter. The lowest price I've ever saw it at was one eighty nine. That's the lowest price. This is the one that's the light colored one. I guess it's white. But one thing about the watch is always look at the different colors because sometimes you look at 225 and you say, "Oh man, I don't really want to pay 225. Look at another color. It might be 199." So look at the different colors. You do that with clothes too. Clothes is the same thing. You know how the thing goes. Sometimes you would buy when you're buying clothes, sometimes you could buy a Let's say it's a T-shirt. You could buy a size that's a little on the larger side, size, and it might be five dollars cheaper <laughs> just by looking at the different sizes. So look at the different sizes. Look at the different colors, uh, whether it's clothes or it's not clothes. Yeah, you look at different things, and sometimes you can get into it. Hey, Dale, how's it going? 
Thanks for stopping in. Yeah, we're going to do a $7.77 gift card. At right up, right up uh, when the when the big hand on the clock hits 12. Yeah, so it's like 777. It's enough, it's enough money to buy a bag of meatballs for the final four. The final four is being played in New Orleans. And one of the one of the big sponsors over there is Reese's. Oh, that's true. I could put I could put the hat up the right way. Yeah, there we go. You know why? Because nobody's in here. I gotta put some names in the hat. Yeah, I gotta put some names in this hat. So I, so I guess I, I, I guess I ought to just start. I guess I ought to start writing some names down. So let me go ahead. By the way, if you're on, if some kind of way you fell on my live stream and you have no idea what is he doing? Oh, what's he, what's this all about? Or where did I go? Yeah, this is just a live stream. I talk about food all the time. I talk about things that you could, you could buy to cook your food. I talk about things that you can use at your house that maybe I used. Because, you know, when it comes down to it, I'm not a I'm not a a weed eater expert. I haven't tried a hundred different weed eaters. I'm not consumer reports or anything, but I can tell you about the one that I have. And if it works for me, it might work for you. Same thing with the watch. I can't tell you about all the other watches that there are. All I can tell you is that they're pretty similar. They're all good manufacturers, but I can tell you definitely about this because, man, I gave this for a test drive. Yeah, big test drive. Well, not this one. It's not this one that did the big test drive. It was this one. This is where it started. You can even find this one. It's still on Amazon. You can get this one at a pretty good price, I'd say, too. Yeah, the thing here is it's a little different. This is the one that actually the head pops out. Yeah, and then you just pop. You got a band. Yeah, you got a band like that, and you just pop it in. I'm surprised. I'm surprised I found the watch. Yeah, because after three years and three months, I was finished because I was going to this one. You know, you can't wear two watches. You got to wear just one. So anyway, I took this one off. But it was good to show you that this is where it all started five years ago. Yeah, five years ago, this is where it all started. And then, like I said, since I documented a journey and had success, because that's what people get it for. They want success. They want success. They want to buy something that 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 you could do something with. You know, like you can watch TV all you want and you can see uh, somebody says, I lost 100 pounds. Yeah, okay. So what did you do? Oh, well, I ate this. And that's how you did it? No, I don't think so. There's a lot more to the story than what you just said on that 30-second commercial. Yeah, there's a lot to it. Well, in this case, I could actually go into detail about exactly what I did. Yeah, this is, I'm just starting that way. But you see, yeah, I, I got into that situation. And the, and the thing is, you got two ways to do it. <laughs> you can back off of what you eat, and that's not fun. That's the thing that got me in trouble all the time because I wanted to eat all kinds. You know, I want, I like ice cream. I don't know about you. I like pizza. I like baby back ribs. I like fried chicken. I like all the stuff that gets you in trouble. Yeah, that's why I like food. I like food. That's, that's stuff that gets you in trouble. So the thing is, if you want to enjoy all that stuff, then you got to be willing to do the work to get rid of it. <laughs> and yeah, I, yeah, I did some, I did some of that. The one thing I can tell you that really helps you a lot is if you could do stairs. A lot of, I, you know, I, I spent a little time in the gym and you know what I realized, you know what I, you know what I found out, man, people don't get on that stair master thing, that thing go, that you climb. That's a lot of work. And a lot of people don't do that. Well, that one helped you. Yeah. If you could do that, it gets you. It definitely uh, gets you going. All right. Well, here's, uh, look, I started Amazon Live on May 1st, 11 months ago. Here's Calvin. Calvin and I did that right in right in the living room. Yeah, we did a 92-minute Amazon Live, and that's where it all started. But I didn't know that I'd be doing Amazon Live for 330 days in a row. Yeah, where's my, where's my, Where's my thing here? Let's see. It's got to be here somewhere. Yeah, here, here we go. 330 days in a row on Amazon Live. That's a lot. Yeah. So anyway, when I first got started, I talked about, I first started talking about the Fitbit because I thought that was a pretty good story because anytime you can write a story and you get 65,000 people to read about it, I guess you did pretty good. So I figured on Amazon Live, that's what I'll do. I'll talk about, I'll talk about the watch. I'll talk about what I ate. I talk about the scale. That I weighed myself on, I talk about the scale that I put my food on. That's how I started. And then later down the road, it was hurricane season. So I figured, well, I've been through Katrina. 
that wasn't fun. No, that was not fun at all. I've been through that. So, hey, I guess I could talk about hurricane stuff. Since I did live in hurricane territory my whole life, except one, I missed one. I missed Hurricane Betsy in 1965. Why? Because I was in California. My dad was in the Navy. And I was he was stationed in California. So I was so at age two or three, you don't have no choice in where you're gonna live, and you don't even know what the what's going on. So that's where I was. So I'm so Hurricane Hurricane Betsy was in 65. When I started the first grade, I heard man, all the kids were talking about this. Oh, Hurricane Betsy. Hurricane Betsy. That's all we heard. I, I talked to my sister about that a while back. Yeah, that's all we heard. That's all people were talking about. Hurricane Betsy, Hurricane Betsy. We didn't know what they were talking about. We had no idea because we've just missed it. But then later on, Hurricane Camille came <laughs> and it was coming for our area in 1969. I remember. Yeah, I was throwing a frisbee in the yard. You throw it up against the wind, and man, that thing went, that frisbee took off and went way up in the sky because the winds were coming down pretty good. We were getting those outer band squalls. But the deal is, I went to sleep. Yeah, I was only eight years old, but I went to sleep thinking that. Yeah, I didn't just think you're eight years old and you boards on the window. What are we getting ready for? A war? You know, it was like, wow, this is, you know, for an eight-year-old, it's something. You're Okay, we're in this house and it's pitch dark. So we went to bed and then unfortunately, uh, you know, I'm, good thing for where we, you know, where we lived at the time, it didn't, it didn't hit. You know, it didn't hit Louisiana, but it hit Mississippi and it really tore things up. So, yeah, the two big storms as far as, you know, my area, it's all about it's all about Camille and 1969 and Katrina in 2005. And then now Ida, Ida was, you know, pretty strong. The one that just came through last year, 2021. We got we got tornadoes. We got tornadoes, stuff, you know, warnings and all kinds of alerts and all. Uh, the phones went crazy that day. I think we had 60 mile an hour winds. So where I was, it wasn't too bad, but other people got, you know, bad, uh, got it, you know, got it pretty bad. And the city pretty much lost electricity the whole, for a long time. That's where the, that's where the generators come in. So I just, so I decided, let's see. So I decided that, yeah, I'll talk about hurricane season. And then the other thing is, since I spent 45 years in the food industry, I talk about food. So that's kind of, kind of what I've been doing. And that's kind of my niche. And the deal is on Amazon Live. If you're looking for something to listen to, if you like, you know, if you like food, then then you could then you could follow, you know, you could follow me what I'm talking about. If you don't, then you know, you could find somebody else. Uh, so, you know, other people talk about clothes. They talk about they talk about pets. They might have they got I, I'm seeing they got people that talk about cats. They got people that talk about dogs. They got people that talk about art projects. They got people that talk about taking care of your kids. They got all kinds of things that might interest you. So if food doesn't interest you, then there's no, you know, on Amazon Live, there's another channel. There's all kinds of other channels to go to. So anyway, let's see. Let me go through. Uh, oh, wow. Look at this. Okay. We got Jeff. I came back. Yep. I, I had jambalaya. I had jambalaya with shrimp and crawfish, some Louisiana crawfish, and it had some sausage in there. Something in there was hot. I don't know where the hot came from. Yeah, Vicky. Let's see. Yeah, so I'm right, going back over that. Yeah, the deal with the uh, yeah the watches are really really good. Any questions about it? Just just ask me. Yeah, the whole, the whole deal is look as far as the watches. Uh, the other part of this. If you get an Apple Watch or you get a if you get an Apple Watch or you get a um, Fitbit or you get a Garmin or you get a Samsung, you need to get a scale too. Let me see. Let me come back here. You need to get a scale here. This is a great one. This is this is, whoever came up with this idea, man, he or she was pretty smart. They put you put the food code at the top and then tells you the calories, the fat calories, the total fat, the sodium, the sugar, the dietary fiber. So the deal is that everybody's different. Some people worry about sugar because they're maybe they're diabetic. Some people worry about salt. Maybe that's all they're worried about. I can eat anything as long as I don't have too much salt. 
Well, then it tells you it tells you that. Yeah, the only thing is if you if if you got to avoid salt, sugar, and fat, then maybe you shouldn't watch this channel because I unfortunately I cover it all. But I also talk about trying to ex <laughs> trying to exercise and getting rid of it. But anyway, this is a good scale to have. It, it's forty seven dollars today, but it was thir it was in the thirties last week. So I bought mine at thirty seven. The lowest price I saw it was thirty two. The highest price I saw was fifty seven. But this is this is an awesome scale because I spent my you know my whole life weighing food. Yeah, I was always weighing food. And one thing about the scales, the scales of today are pretty accurate compared to what they used to be. So if you get the scale, if you get the scale and you and you get oh the other the other part of the thing is you got to get a scale to weigh yourself on. And Fitbit's got a scale that you get a Fitbit scale, and it's like thirty nine dollars. I paid one hundred thirty dollars five years ago. It's down to thirty nine dollars, and you could get other scales to go with it, but it really. It really works out good. Let's see. Let me let me go further down through the comments. Okay, Tink's here, screaming for ice cream. With this, we've got the same usual characters. Dale's here. Gavin's here. Uh, Calvin's doing fine. He was watching some dog. He was watching a movie about a dog. With uh, I don't know if you know the movie. I think it was Peter Fonda that was in that movie. Yeah, I think Peter Fonda was in that movie. They had another big star in there. I was I was looking when the credits were coming through. They Spent a lot of money on that dog movie. Some dog. It was about a dog. That's what he was watching. Faustino's here. Choosing Happy's here. Yeah. We got Kmart Kelly. Yeah. Yeah. If you like if you like Reese's and you like food, you're on the right channel. Leia. Leia's here. Thanks so much for the follow. I appreciate it. That's what the thing's all about. I'm trying to, you know, I'm I'm a I'm not considered an A-list. I'm not an A-lister. Um, so I don't get the big, you know, I don't get the big streams where you got two and three and four and five and six and 700 people. I only, you know, I work hard to do my 30, 40, 50, 60. So it's all about trying to get to the 2000. So I could maybe one day have 100, 200, 300, 400, 500 people on at a time. That would be great. That'd be super. That's what I'm working on. I'm working on it one at a time. <laughs> I got to pretty much, you know, I don't, I don't know if I can do it, but I got to get like 10 followers a day for the next three months. Yeah. Yeah. Basically that's what it comes down to April, May, and June. I'm trying, you know, my goal is like July 1st, trying to at least by July 1st to try to have 2000 followers, but I don't know if I'll get there. It's pretty, that's pretty tough, but I'll try. Uh, yeah, Calvin, I, I tried to, it almost, yeah. The, you know, Calvin's going to be, live yeah what i gotta do is i can't get them in my office because there's no way i could get a wheelchair i don't have enough room they got wires everywhere lights lights wires stuff sticking out all over the place so i when i'm here i'm i gotta be very careful when i'm walking around just to knock anything down but anyway i usually i usually stick calvin in the kitchen i put him in the kitchen and we just answer questions i don't usually have a lot of product it's hard to have you know it's hard to take everything that's up here and then bring it downstairs so, but he's going to be, he's going to be on soon. He's kind of, he's, yeah, I think he was on, uh, I think he was on 10 days ago or something like that. So yeah, he's, he's due, he's due to come back. So he's going to be, uh, he's going to be here later. Let's see. My fingers are too big for those watch, those watch watches. I always touch the wrong thing. Yeah, I know it's, it's, uh, yeah, it's, uh, it's a learning experience trying to figure out what you got to do to get what you want. And then it goes to the wrong screen and you wonder, oh, what I got to do to get back? You know, it's all about taking the time to read all the directions. But I don't like to read directions. I like it just to work. I like it to be easy and just work with it. That's what I. Yeah. So that's, that. you know, that's the part about that. I get to the point where at least I look at my watch and then check to see if I moved. And I didn't move too much today. <laughs> Yeah, I'm looking right now. Oh man, I didn't I didn't move too much today. So I gotta yeah, I gotta get on get on the road. I gotta maybe cut maybe cut the grass tomorrow and get me some get get myself moving. All right, so I'm gonna let me go ahead and uh start writing names. Let me get that done. Let me see, let me see. All right, I'm gonna get let's see, I got my I got my paper and I got my pen, so I'm ready. All right. Let's see here. I got I got Jeff. 
Okay, the hat starts all from scratch. Nobody's in the castle. Yeah, nobody's in the castle now. We gotta start from scratch. So that so whoever's here tonight, um, a much better chance. Okay, I got Vicky. Okay, I got Vicky. Let's see. I got Vicky. I got Tink and screaming for ice cream. Tink. Screaming for ice cream. All right, screaming for ice cream. I got Dale. I got Gavin. Dale, Gavin, Faustino. Dale. Gavin. Faustino. See, this is good therapy for me because I'm learning how to write again. Because I don't... <laughs> Because when you don't write too often, you tend to forget how to write. <laughs> when you try to write a check, you're like lost. You know, your brain's not connected to your hand to try to figure out how to write. Yeah, you spend all your time typing, you just forget to write. Faustino. Okay, choosing happy. Okay, choosing happy. I got Kmart Kelly already, right? Yep, I got Kmart Kelly. I got Dale. Yeah, we got Dale. Got to put Le Leia. Okay, I got Leia. Thanks for the follow again, uh, just in case I didn't say it before. I think I did, but just to make sure. Dale, I got I got Tink. Uh, let's see. I got to put Angelica. 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 Okay, Dale, screaming for ice cream, Dale. Let's see. I think I got everybody. Tink. All right, Tink's got it now. Let's see. Let's see. Let me see if it matches up. Jeff, Kmart Kelly, Vicky, Tink, screaming for ice cream, Dale, Gavin, Faustino, Faustino, choosing happy, Leia, Angel, Leia. Yeah, I just got to gotta put, yeah, I put the new, uh, I put the new follower, I put Leia in there, and then Angelica. All right, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and, uh, oh, I got more. I got more. I got more. I got Bernadine and Victoria. All right, Bernadine. Bernadine. And Victoria. All right, Victoria. All right, Victoria. Are the alligators out yet? No, they're they're. I don't know. Somebody's got them on, got them got them contained right now. But they're gonna be loose soon. Yeah, in fact, they're gonna be real. Hey, only seventeen minutes. They're gonna be let go. Seventeen minutes. I better get. I better get moving. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. They might get a jump on the clock. You never know. They might be out there early. Under the time. Yeah, he might get. Roberto might get eaten. Yeah. Hey, Matt. Boy, <laughs> Matt Shea, I had no idea Amazon had live streams. Yeah, that you're not the only one. There's there's millions of people that have no idea that there's such a thing as Amazon Live. Okay, Matt, I'm gonna put you in. I'm gonna put you in the hat. I'm making a. I'm pulling names for a seven dollar and seventy seven cent gift card. That's about the that's about the best prize you can get because it's like it's almost like cash. All right, so I'll put Matt. Matt, I got you. Hey, if you're not following me, go ahead and hit that follow button. All right, you already did. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Hey, I got two extra ones today. Hey, watch out. Uh, let's see. Victoria. Let's see how we're doing now. Let's see. Oh, got Jennifer. Got Jen Look, the alligator's are already out. <laughs> hey, don't let them out too early. We don't want any innocent people getting eaten. Let's see, Jennifer. Yeah. Got to watch them gators. They're not, they eat everybody. Laurie. Laurie. Laurie B. Got Reagan. All right, got Reagan. Let's see what else, if there's anybody else. Bridge is now, Randall's Bridge is now closed. Not yet, not, let, not yet, not yet, Jeff. No, don't close it yet. <laughs> It's open. It's open until oh, it's got 45 minutes. I mean, I'm sorry. It's got uh, 15 more minutes. 
It closes in 15 minutes. The bridge is going to be closed. It's going to start going up. Oh, yeah. It's going. Yeah, it's still open. Yeah, Jeff, it's still open. Got 15 minutes. Got 15 minutes. Got 15 minutes. Oh, uh, we can't. We can't. We can't close off uh, people that are trying to get in the trying to get in the castle. Yeah, let's see. By the way, if you drive around, if you drive around on I-10 in Louisiana, there is a castle. If if you're out in the eastern part of New, yeah, east of New Orleans, and you're driving towards Slidell, Louisiana, and you look, yeah, if you're in New Orleans and you're heading towards Slidell, and you look to the right, there's a castle. There is a there's a castle, a real castle. <laughs> On the side, uh, yeah. The last first time I saw it, I was like, "You got to be kidding!" Yes, it sure is. It's a castle. Yep, I'm sure the castle went up in value too. Bet you did. Uh oh, Roberto, Roberto got in. Yep, we were thinking what you might get eaten by the gators, but I guess not. All right, Roberto, Roberto's in. Ah, uh, yeah. So let's see, random. You can scratch my name off. I'll be off soon. Oh, okay. It's 15 minutes, just so you know, in 15 minutes. 14 minutes down the road. 14 minutes down the road. Yeah, 14 minutes. Uh-oh. Now I got Richard. Got to get Richard. All right. Got to get Richard on there. Takes a while. Oh. Man, look at that list. That list growing fast. Okay. Got Richard. Richard's on there. Richard, Roberto, Reagan, Laurie B., Jennifer Lude, Matt Shea, Bernadine, Victoria. All right. We got it. Yep. Got it. Got it. Got it. All right. I'm going to. Okay. Where we're at? Where we're at? Where we're at? Okay. 13 minutes. 13 minutes. Yeah. Yeah. We were wondering if Richard was here. But yeah. Richard. Richard's here. Richard's here. Yeah, sometimes people get eaten by alligators and we never know outside. Yeah, so we got 1132, 1,132 followers. Yeah, I'd love to get two two or three more. That would be great, but I don't know. Was why, hey, what's the score? What's the score? What's the score? I don't know. What's the score? Yeah, I don't blame you. I should, I should be watching the game too. Yeah. I was watching March Madness. Anybody got the score? Let me know. Oh, oh watch out. Tink's going to take care of the alligators. Wow. Yeah, you got. it's got to be a special person to do the alligators. Because if you don't know what you're doing, it could be dangerous. Yeah, because... One thing, one thing that we do here, I know a lot of people don't know this, but they do actually, we have alligator. You can buy alligator, alligator meat in, uh, you know, Louisiana. That's one of the, you know, that's one of the seafoods over here. we got alligator. I know a lot of people have never tried alligator. I understand that, but it's for real. It's not, it's not, it's not a joke. It's, it's, it's a real deal. But with all the alligators we got in our moat, we, you never know. If you get hungry, well, at least we got, at least we're, at least, yeah, at least we're feeding the alligators with late arrivals. <laughs> All right. Uh, late, yeah, late arrivals get, uh, don't get treated too well. <laughs> when, once that bread starts going up, it, it, that's what happens. Okay. Let me see if I cover some of my carousel before I, before we even draw something. Yeah, I didn't ever even got past the Fitbit. All right, let's see. All right, look, I put the Intex uh, kayak in here. Okay, the kayak's a good price, but I can't guarantee crossage over the moat. Uh, that might not be a good idea. Alligators could pierce through the Intex lining. Yeah, th these alligators are not not your normal alligators. They're pretty, yeah, they're pretty aggressive, so not recommended. But if you're in a place where there's no alligators, you know, uh, the Intex kayak, that's that price is right. Last year, yeah, <laughs> yeah, the, uh oh, uh oh, North Carolina and Duke 67 67. How much time left? Oh, whoa, watch out, watch out. 
let's see. Let me, let me just, uh, let me, let me just, I guess, put the score thing on the side here. Yeah. What's, uh oh, it's Duke 68 67 with 332 left. Uh oh. Uh oh. All right. It's close. It's close for sure. All right. So the Intex kayak, not going to do you no good getting across the moat. But I can tell you that if you don't if you don't get it at 97 and you wait till the summertime, it's gonna cost a lot more money for sure. For sure, for sure, for sure. Hey, I got the DeWalt in here. This DeWalt's selling really well. It's one of my top 10 items. It it always did well. It did well last year. It's doing well this year. This one, this 10-inch table saw with the wheels and the legs and everything is $529. What I'm finding is that the that a lot of this product is pretty competitively priced, very aggressively priced in the off season. But when it gets when it gets hot, the price gets up there. The price definitely gets up there. Hey, look, I talked about the Apple AirTag for a while, just about keeping your keys. Yeah, if you find your keys, depending on who you are, you might be able to open the door where the alligators are at. And, then, you know, somebody's got to let them go. Got to let them go. So the deal is if you could find your keys, you could open whatever doors you need to open up. You could open your apartment door. You could open your house door. You could open your car, your truck. Maybe you drive a cab for a living. Maybe you could open the cab. You know, whatever. You need your keys. So the Apple AirTag finds them. Hey, I put the Weber Genesis grill in here. How much time I got left? I got eight minutes before I got to pull the first name. Yeah, the Weber Genesis is $12.99. I, I cooked on a lot of grills. I cooked on a lot of different grills, you know, in my time. But when I got old, Stacy's mom. Yeah, let's put Stacy's mom in there. Let, yeah, we got to get Stacy's mom in there. Stacy's mom is in. Okay, Stacy's mom is in. Okay, we got we got that. We got that taken care of. Okay, I, well, you know, I'm never going to pass this opportunity to show this. You know this, you know. One thing about being in the food business, food's much more exciting than a lot of other things. Well, first of all, let's see how Calvin's doing. This was Calvin guarding the, the barbecue pit the other day. All right, Calvin, tell me, tell me how many burgers you want. Four. Four? You can't eat four Terry Bradshaw burgers. Yeah, no, you can't. That's too many, Calvin. That's too many Bradshaw burgers. Yeah, he said if you put it in front of him, he's gonna he's gonna knock them out. He's gonna make them disappear. Yeah, that's what that's what he told me he was gonna do. By the way, we had six burgers. I had John Greathouse. He's in the he's in the chat sometimes. He stopped by. He ate one of the burgers that left us with five. Between Calvin and I, I don't know my wife and my mother in law. I don't know for some reason they did, they weren't around when we were eating the burgers, so we we took care of them. <laughs> yeah, we we took care of them. We ate. We ate five of them. I ate it before the Amazon Live, and then I did the Amazon Live for, I don't know, three hours or whatever, and then I ate. Then late at night before I went to bed, I ate more of the burgers. So Calvin and I, we ate it. We didn't have – we didn't have – we didn't have the buns because the buns got eaten before we <laughs> – we ate the buns before we ate, got the hamburger. So we ate it on some uh, King's Hawaiian bread, and we ate it on some French bread. We just didn't have the buns. Hopefully next time we got the buns. But here, there's nothing more exciting. You know, there's very few things more exciting than seeing this, especially if you like well-done burgers. Burgers are cooking. Man, they're looking good. Looking good, Calvin. We're going to be eating good in our neighborhood. Yeah. All right. Like, Hey, one of the things I always talk about is the fact that I like to, I like to cook them well done. I like always. Hi, huh, Calvin. We always eat them well done. I know there's a lot of people that like them rare and medium and all that kind of stuff, but um, my favorite's just uh, well done. Harry Brown. Yeah, those things look good, right? I mean, they're looking real good. All right, it's getting hot here with my lights. Hold on, let me put the fan on. Let me put the fan on. All right, I got the fan blowing. Yeah, I'm up. I'm upstairs, so all the heat comes up here. Yeah, I didn't I didn't turn on the AC before I got in here cuz you never know, but after a while, it, I don't know, for some reason it gets on the hot side. So, got to get the I got to get the air circulating here. 
How much time we got? I only got five minutes left. I got to see who's in the. I'm sure there's going to be another entry before it's all. Let's see. Oh, Jesus made it. Uh oh. Uh oh. Hey, yeah, let me go ahead and put the. You know what? I never even put the phrase. Let me put the phrase. Never put the phrase up. Let me see where it is. Yeah, let's see. There we go. There's the phrase. Yeah, that's all. You, that, that's all. It, like if you're somebody new or whatever, or if you want to get my attention, yeah, you just put that, and that increases the chance of me seeing you and putting you in the in the hat, in the Reese's hat. Okay, let me check on the final four score. Let's see. The score is 68 to 67. Is that the score? Let's see. Let me update it. Uh-oh. It's 74, Duke. 73, North Carolina. Watch out. This is, wow, this is, we might have to, we might have to take a, a five-minute break or something. Let's see. Yeah, we're okay. One thing I one thing I could say, since there's only one minute left, we won't pull the name until the game's over. Okay, let the let the game finish. It's only got one minute. Yeah, we, I don't want I don't want to pull the name and then everybody's watching the game and then you then you then five people didn't show up because they were watching the game. And I don't blame you. I don't blame you. I'd be watching the game too. Yeah, uh, that's that's the way I that's the way I see it. So. Yeah, so we'll shut the we'll shut it at we'll shut it in three minutes. The alligators are gonna be loose, but we won't pull the name out of the hat until after the game is concluded. Yeah, let's see if we got it. Let's see if I got it all there. Let's see. Ah, uh, okay. Do I? I don't think I have Lewis, so I gotta put Lewis. Uh, Lewis is in. Let's see. What about busy? I don't think I got busy. No, I don't have busy. So busy is in. Busy's in the hat. Busy's in the hat. Who else? Serene. Let's see. Serene G. Did Serene G get in there? Uh, no. Let's get Serene G. Serene G. Um, let me come back to. Let me come back to one of my databases here. Let's see, you got you got Jesus. Got Jesus. Stacy's mom is in. We got Richard, right? Yeah, I got Richard. Got Roberto. I got Reagan. Laurie B. Uh, let's see. I think I got er I think I got everybody. I think I do. I think I do. I think I do. I'm a looking. I'm a looking. Yeah, we'll check it out after further review. We'll check it out. We'll make sure that because it's getting close to let. Okay, we're gonna let that when the alligators get gone. They're gonna be roaming. They're gonna be roaming the moat, looking for last minute people that missed it. Because once once the once it's over, it's over. And then we're going to take a pause for the end of the game because, it, man, it, talk about how in the world did I plan this right at the final of the of the final four? I don't know. Let's see. Let's see where it's at. Let's see. Uh-oh, 40. Uh-oh, North Carolina's winning. Whoa, 46 seconds. 46 seconds. 46 seconds. 46 seconds. da 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 46 seconds. All right, I'm coming back. Sorry, just got done swimming my lap. <laughs> and I made it in one piece. Uh oh, Serene's still here. She made it. She got back. And it is possible. She she could actually win again. It's very possible. It could happen. I haven't seen I don't think we had anybody win back to back, though. I don't think anybody's ever done that. They won uh, one day and then won the next day, but they, nobody's ever won back to back. So one day somebody's going to be that person. I don't know who that's going to be. All right, it looks like it looks like um, we're going to have to 
looks like we'll have to shut the door because it looks like it's 10 o'clock. Okay, no, it's going to shut down. It's shutting down, but we're not picking it until after the game's over. Uh, and the game's over in, you know, two or three minutes or whatever. Oh, it's done. That's it. That's it. That's it. That's it. That's it. That's it. It's gone. We got the snapping turtles out there. We got the gators out there. Not to be met, not to be confused with crocodiles. You know, you might see some movies where they have crocodiles, but they don't have that in Louisiana. They got gators. Yeah, I got the gators there. So I don't know if the, if the emoji is a crocodile or whatever. I can't see it, but anyway, it works good for us. Yeah, and if yeah, it's too late. So whatever happens now. Uh, everybody's everybody's in so all right y'all safe anybody else it's too late too late once those once all those gators oh yeah the bridge is closed that's it that's it okay so y'all can relax now let's see let me come back let me see what's happening with the game here let's see let's see uh oh 10 seconds left uh oh it doesn't look like oh, oh man Okay, I, I'm I'm sorry. I can't pull a name right now until the game's over. It only has 10 seconds left. So uh, are these gators, yeah, these gators are getting impatient. So I wouldn't mess with it. I wouldn't try to sneak in because it's too late. It's too late. It's too late. Too late. Can't get, can't get in the drawing. All right, let me come back. Let me see. I... Uh-oh. Ten seconds left. Ten seconds. Oh yeah, that ten seconds could take a while. I wish I had it. I wish I had it live, but I don't. All right. The contestants are in. No extra. Nobody can slip in. It's too late. You can't slip in on the first on the first on the first pull. You can. You can. You could hang out with the Gators right now and wait to the second drawing, but you can't be in the first drawing. It's too late. Too late. Too late. And I'm not gonna, out of respect for the final four, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna pull Duke shooting two. Okay. All right. Let me see. Um. Yeah, you gotta. Yeah, how do you make up for that three-point deficit? Got one. Got one point there. Oh man. This could be uh, you know, this could be a five-minute delay here. Seventy nine, seventy seven. Can it be? Can Duke be knocked out? Can it? Is it possible? Can Duke be gone? It's going to be. Uh oh, seven seconds. I see seven seconds now. I see seven. Something must have happened. All right, I'm kind I'm gonna come back. Come back. Let me see the chat. Seven seconds left to the game. Out of respect for the game, we're not going to pull it until after. No more. Anybody that shows up at the drawbridge has to wait till the next one comes down. I think so. I think North Carolina's got it. Are you watching the basketball game? I'm. I'm not. I can't. I don't have the t. I don't have the TV. Uh, yeah. I don't. I don't see it. I, I'll. I'll see it after. I'll see the completion later. But let's see. It must be coming to an end real soon. Uh oh. I see. I see a. <laughs> I see a three-point separation there. Eighty to seventy-seven. North Carolina. North Carolina. Eighty seventy-seven. I spent a little bit of time in North Carolina. I went. I spent a little bit of time out there. All right. We're on pause. Activity has 
currently been suspended due to the due to the game. <laughs> I'm looking. I wish. Let's see what the time is now. It's still 80 to 77. And you know they're gonna uh oh 81 to 77. Uh oh. I uh oh now it's gonna be uh kind of difficult. Can North Carolina pull this one off? It looks like looks like they will, but anything can happen, and it usually does. 81 to 77. Three seconds left. Three seconds left. 81, 77. Three seconds left. Only three seconds. And a half, too. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I. Well. That uh, looks like I, I can't see what's going on, but I can about imagine. All right, I'm coming back to my chat. I got to come back to my chat now. Let's see. Watch out for the Gators. <laughs> All right, let's see. Hello, hello. That's true. Watch out for the Gators, Angelo. <laughs> Final. North Carolina. North Carolina. Watch out. Watch out. It's over for Duke. Yeah. Anything can happen. Okay, now we got now we can now we get no matter what happens with the game, unless you unless you're betting on the game, you know, you can get richer or poor based on that. But but if you don't if you don't have any money on the game, then you can't you can't win no money. But you can watch to see who see who gets caught up with the gators. All right. Let me see. Let me see something here. Oh, 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 so it's going to rebranding. Oh, it's going to get confusing now. That's for sure. Okay. It's time to go ahead. I guess it's time for me to cut up the cut up things now. All right. This is what I, this is what I, this is what I have. I got, I got Jeff, Kmart Kelly, Vicky, Tink. Screaming for ice cream, Dale, Gavin, Faustino, choosing happy. Got Le Leia. I got uh, Angelica. I got Bernadine, Victoria Diaz. I got Matt Shea. I got Jennifer. I got Laurie B. I got Reagan. I got Roberto Jr., Richard, Stacy's mom, Luis, Busy, Serene G, and Jesus. Yep, that's who I got. That's who's going into. Calvin's hat now. Yep. The bridge has been closed for eight minutes now. We closed the bridge. No. <laughs> the bridge, the bridge is full of gators already. And it's you can anybody that shows up after the bridge went up. Uh oh. Alan, Alan's gotta hang out with the gators until we get up until we go ahead and Hold the name. Yep. Alan's gonna be on the second shift because the gators are all over. I don't I don't suggest anybody go jump in the jump in the moat because it's full of it's full of gators and snapping turtles. And those snapping turtles are pretty mean. Oh, not to mention we got we got pelicans flying above. <laughs> yeah, those those are some those are some pretty bad birds. Yeah, the Pelicans. All right. Jesus is the first one in the hat. Jesus is the first one in the hat. And the Reese's peanut butter cup hat. All right. We got Bernadine. We got Victoria Diaz. We got Matt Shea. We got Jennifer. We got Laurie B. We got Reagan. We got Roberto Jr. We got Richard. 
We got Stacy's mom. We got Luis. We got Dizzy. We got Serene G. Serene G completed her lap and she's back. She didn't get eaten. Even though there was there was a few gators left over in the water, she got back. So she gets to she gets to participate again. Can she be the first back-to-back -back winner? I don't know. We'll see. And Angelica, we got Lay, Leia. We got Choosing Happy. We got Faustino. I'm, I'm trying not to cut my finger. Gavin, because this scissors is sharp and it can cut. I got Dale. I got Screaming for Ice Cream. I got Tink. I got Vicky. I got Kmart Kelly. And I got Jeff. Those are all the... Hey, if y'all know who's got to go into the second round, we got some second round people that can jump back, jump in, get into the castle. Yeah. That was it. That The door got closed, so it was... Uh, yeah, that's it. That's it. Okay. All right, we got it. We got it. Yeah, if yeah, if you know who's who gets to come in after the drawbridge come, comes down, let me know. I think it might be one or two people. Alan's won. Alan wants to get in on the second on the second go round. Yeah, because when that bridge closed, it was closed. It was closed. Definitely. By the way, they might have catfish and garfish in the moat, too. If you've never seen garfish, that's pretty ugly fish. Yeah, the garfish. It's in it's in that it's in the moat, too. Yeah, because if we're gonna do a moat, we just as soon do a Louisiana moat, you know, put the stuff. We don't have any salmon uh floating in our moat. We got catfish. Yeah, we don't have none. Let's see. Okay. All right. All right. Okay, I'm ready. I'm ready. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Next round. Okay, good. Thank you, Richard. Appreciate that. All right. Thank you so much, Angelo. That's exactly what I thought it was. Angelo, Allen, and... and and uh, Tina, you snooze, you lose. Okay. <laughs> All right. I got a name. I got a name. I don't know what it is. I hope whoever it is is here and didn't get eaten up by the alligators. All right. And the winner is, this is for, for, I know it's kind of, it's, wait, hold on. Hold on. Just a second. Just a second. Just a second. Yeah. Hey, the way I did this for this weekend. If you're watching the if you're watching the finals on Monday, you might need something to feed your company. Whatever meatballs work out pretty good, especially in an Instapot. You put it in the Instapot, you steam them, and you got you got some good food in your neighborhood. Yeah, it actually you just keep steaming and it stays hot the whole game from the first period to the second. You know, the first half to the second half. So I'm giving a gift card seven dollars and seventy seven cents, and it's enough to buy some meatballs if you want to. You can't do it with the gift card, but you know what I'm saying. All right, I'm turning it over, and the winner is it's Jesus. Jesus. Jesus won. Jesus won two days ago. So Jesus is a Jesus won again. Watch out. Watch out. Jesus. Jesus. So I got his I got his uh address already. All right, we're already at 1014. The next drawing is 45 minutes away. 45 minutes away. 45 minutes. All right, let me get uh let me get the address up. Hey Zeus, send me a send me a deal saying that you won seven dollars and seventy-seven cents on the Rosina promo or whatever. Um, as long as it's related, if it's Rosina and it's seven dollars and seventy-seven cents, that's what I need to know. I just write when you when I pull the name, I'll write the amount of the prize right next to the name when I pull it. So but it, it is good to see it coming from from whoever sends me the email, it's always good to check and recheck. And it's always good to find an address. That's too. That's true too. So Jesus already knows my address. So 
I don't even I don't even really have to put it up there, I guess. All right. Let's see. Let me put the let me write the seven dollars and seventy seven cents. So so serene and alley cat and Jesus and screaming for ice cream all one seven dollars and seventy seven cents. Who's gonna win the next one? Well, it could be it could be Alan. Who was on that list? Let me see who was on that list. Alan, Tina, and Evans, I think. Was it? Was it? Was it? Let me see. Who's on that? Who's on that? Let's see. Let's see. Where was that? Candy Z's started following. Thanks so much. Appreciate that. Yeah, thank you. This feels like, yeah, it is. It's kind of subliminal advertising. You see in the meatballs and the burgers and all the food. Oh, yeah. Oh, wait. The timer. Oh, man. Oh, oh, oh. I'm sorry. No, I, lo I lost. Okay, so didn't show up. I'll put, wait. Let me let me go ahead and put it. Oh man, I wish. Hey Siri, 30 seconds. 30 seconds. Counting down. It's already 23. Hey Siri, the timer. The timer has about seven seconds left. All right. That's uh oh. All right. Got to do it over. I'm sorry. I just, uh, I just thought that I thought that it was here. I, that's how it goes. That's how it goes. Candy Z. All right. All right. I have to. Uh, you know, sometimes you got to take them off the board. It's like kicking the fuel go and then taking it off the board so that you could. Uh... All right. All right. So he's he's back in the hat for the next go round, but he doesn't doesn't win this go round. All right. Yeah, don't mess around with the Gators. OK, so I have to go ahead and make another pick then. Sorry about that. I just I just thought I just thought. He was here. I just thought he was here, but apparently not. All right. I'm pulling another name. Yeah. <laughs> uh, y'all got to keep me. Y'all got to keep me together in the right direction. Y you guys are experts at all this giveaway stuff. Yeah. Poor Jesus. Missed, missed out on his $7.77 deal. All right. Here we go. I got another one. Like I say all the time, I hope whoever it is is here. Not like last time. All right. And the winner is, and it's upside down. It ends with a E-E-N. Oh, it's Bernadine. Bernadine, first time winner. Because I don't think Bernadine ever won, but is Bernadine here? That's the, that's the, wait, let me, all right. <clears throat> Let me get that timer going. Got hey Siri, 30 second timer. 30 seconds starting now. Is Bernadine here? Is she here? Is she here? I don't think so. Is she? Is Bernadine here? I'm looking, I'm looking, I'm looking. Bernadine is here. Bernadine is here. I see. You're right. You got it. Okay, Bernadine. All right, I got to put, I got to go ahead and put the $7.77 deal here then. $7.77. So now, so now Bernadine, Serene, 
Alley Cat and Screaming for Ice Cream have all won $7.77 gift cards. Okay, Bernadine, I need you to send the send your send your contact information over to Made in USA Foods at Outlook.com. Yeah, that's great. That's great, great, great. Oh, let's see. How about that? All right. Bernadine is here and she's here. That's all you got to do. Made in USA Foods at Outlook.com. Otherwise, we'll probably find you later. We'll probably find you later just in case. All right. Go ahead and email it to Made in USA Foods at Outlook.com. That's it. That's it. That's it. Well, I'm moving on. Okay. The next, the next drawing is in 40 minutes. The drawbridge. Oh, somebody got to let the drawbridge back down. Alan's got to get in. <laughs> Alan's Alan's got to get in. Tina's got to get in. Let the let the drawbridge down. Don't be looking too close to the gators because there may be a few of them swimming around. All right. Angelo, Alan, Tina, Candy, Evans. Watch when you walk over the bridge. They got snapping turtles too. Uh oh, God, we might have to add Jimmy. Got to got to put Jimmy in there. Jimmy, got to put Jimmy in the list. Jimmy in the list. Jimmy, Jimmy, the, the 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 bridge is back down. And if you travel around south of Louisiana, there's a lot of bridges. <laughs> a lot of bridges. We got to wait for them to come back down. Yeah, a lot of them. All right, I got the Weber Genesis. All right, I don't... Uh, I, I'm never going to pass this opportunity. I'm sorry. I'm going to do it again. Here's the burgers, just, just in case y'all hungry now. Hey, if you finish watching the game, you might be hungry. They're cooking. Man, they're looking good. Looking good, Calvin. We're going to be eating good in our neighborhood. Yeah. All right. Like, Hey, one of the things I always talk about is the fact that I like to, I like to cook them well done. Yeah, I like them well done. How do you like them? Let me know. How do you like your burgers? Yeah, how do you like your burgers? Let me know. Yeah, okay, we got some burgers. Oh yeah, I like that. I like that emoji with the burgers. Yeah. The burger burgers. Well done. Well done. How many people well how many people like well done? Well done. Well done's the way to go. Hold on just one hold on just one second. Let me see. I, I hear Calvin uh screaming, yelling for something. Hold on a second. I will be back in just a second. Be right back. Be right back. Okay, I'm back. I'm back. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Uh, we're pulling in 37. Pulling another name in 37 minutes. The bridge should be down. The bridge should be down. All right. So anyway, the uh, the Bubba Burgers. Look, I, the Bubba Burgers are good, just in case you don't know. Just in case you never bought them. They're pretty good, I got to say. Uh, they have... They have one. If you know me, if if you know anything, if you listen to me for any time, you know that if I had an opportunity to get this one, if I can find it, yeah, you know I'd be looking for this one, the bacon cheddar one. That's the one that I I would have liked to have gotten, but I had to settle. I had to settle for just a plain bubble burger, but it it worked out good. And then the other company, this is uh, this is actually. Thick and juicy. This is the thick and juicy brand, but they put Terry Bradshaw's face on it. Yeah, there we go, Terry Bradshaw. Yeah, so this was the other burger. Put three of these and three of the other ones. That's what we put on the grill. Good stuff. Yeah, and like I say, I'm gonna I'm gonna go ahead and later on down the road, I'm gonna increase my footage and get some get some um, you know get some sausage on the grill, some chicken breast on the grill. And get some, you know, some things that look good that make you hungry. Yeah, 
before you go to bed. Because I always do the late night stuff, you know. So nothing like eating a nothing like eating some, you know, some ribs or some uh, barbecue chicken or something before you go to bed, right? Right, right, right. Yeah, here we go. I got some chicken right here. You know what I mean? Yeah, some Tyson chicken. Now that goes good on the grill. Yeah, that goes real good on the grill. You know what else goes good on the grill? Yeah, if I could find it. Some baby back ribs. Yeah, this is Smithfield. Yeah, Smithfield baby back ribs work. Yeah. Yeah, and if you got time, you could always, uh, you know. Well, this might go good on the Traeger. If you get the Traeger grill, you could smoke a pork butt. Yeah. Now you put this pork butt in your Instapot Duo, Chris. You could do that. And then you know what else goes on good on the grill? <laughs> it's some, some Johnsonville brats. Yeah, that goes good too. You see how you see how I got the Cajun ones, right? Yeah, they make all kinds of sausage. I mean, all kinds. That goes good on the grill. So I got to get some of that on the grill later and get some photos. Yeah, get some, I mean, get some some footage. Yeah, here we go. We got. Yeah, we always we're always doing red beans and rice, or jambalaya, or gumbo. So you need sausage. This is out of Baton Rouge, Louisiana. This is out of Bugaloosa, Louisiana. This is this is out of Southwest Louisiana. Out of Opelousas. You got Richards. I gotta get a photo of Richards. That's out of that's out of Church Point, Louisiana. And then you got Kaneka out of Alabama. See, we like Calvin loves that Alabama sausage, so he's happy about that. Look, look, here's Calvin. <laughs> Yeah, Calvin, uh, Calvin definitely, uh, he's not going to be able to wear that jacket too much longer. It's going to be too hot. And then you got Chassacy sausage out of New Orleans, Louisiana, specifically. Uh, ha uh, it's, it's in Jefferson. Yeah, Jefferson, Louisiana, out by the Huey P. Long Bridge. So if you know where the Huey P. Long Bridge is, that's where it is. They actually make it in the old A&P warehouse. You remember, y'all remember A&P? Yeah. But, oh, here's the regular Bubba Burgers. That's the regular ones. Yeah, that was the big prize. That was that $25 gift card prize, the Bubba Burgers. Okay, let's see. I'm going to get a little further. The pri Hey, the prize is going to be picked up. I'm going to pick the name. And, well, I'm going to be – somebody's going to be letting the Gators out in 33 minutes. Yeah, in 33 minutes, the Gators are going to be loose. Snapping turtles, too. Pelican's going to be flying overhead. And then the drawbridge is going to go up in 32 in 32 minutes. And it's getting closer and closer. Yeah, and if you don't get in the, you know, if you don't get in the castle, you won't be able to win the gift card. All right, let me go back. Let me go back. Going back, going back, going back to my carousel. Today's National Peanut Butter and Jelly Day today. Yeah, that's what today is. Uh, ice creams, ice creams called in the night. Yeah, we will, we will see you later. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. If I have all that stuff, if I have all that stuff out there, yeah, you, yeah, there's a lot of people that said they like, you know, the stuff that I because I always got all kinds of different things that they usually like. Let's see. So in a way, this is kind of this is kind of what I this is kind of what I did when I was a when I start well I had a brokerage I had a food brokerage company I started 35 years ago and basically I represented a lot of different manufacturers from all over the U.S. So the deal is I used to get product in from manufacturers they used to send me like a you know a FedEx with the with the ice with you know if you sell frozen foods or refrigerated you know you usually got dry ice or wet or pat or the um the cold packs or whatever you want to call them they sent it to me like they'll send three of each or four of each or five of each or something and then I'd give it to one buyer or give it to another buyer or give it to another buyer and sometimes I had one for me and then sometimes I had an extra one and I could give it to somebody else so I used to so if you did a food show and let's say you got 30 pounds of sausage and you cooked uh, only 20 of it, you had 10 pounds left, then then you, you're in a situation where you give it to somebody. So I used to give 
I used to give stuff all, you know, all the time I had food that I could give different people, whatever. Okay. So now on Amazon Live, it's kind of the same thing because now I'm going to work with a lot of the manufacturers that I worked with, you know, during my time and see if I could kind of share some of the food with regular consumers, you know, just regular consumers. Why it's got to be a buyer. So it used to be buyers I used to give stuff to because they used to make decisions for 100 stores or 200 stores or 500 stores. Now it's now it's kind of like everybody that's on Amazon is like a regular buyer, like just like a regular just like a regular person just like everybody else. And I don't know about you. I wouldn't mind you know a 2 pound piece of cheese or um, a 3 pound pack of you know, three pounds of bacon or something like that. I wouldn't mind. So that's uh, that's kind of what I'm doing. I'm kind of like giving meatballs away, but it's not really. I'm giving you a gift card. The best prize that you could ever get is cash anyway, right? Cash or, or gift card from Amazon. Because if you can't find $7.70 worth of stuff at Amazon, then I don't know what you need there. Yeah, you can buy all kinds of stuff. You can find all kinds of stuff that you need on Amazon. Oh, by the way, yeah, you know what? I've been talking about Louisiana all the time, but yeah, the po' boys down here, they make the po' boys with the blue plate mayonnaise. This is a big deal. This is a big deal down here. So, like, you can get this, a $7.77. You could probably buy two jars of this. Yeah, this is real popular down here. This is some southern mayonnaise. Yeah, on the on the East Coast, you got Duke. You got Dukes. But in the South, in the deep South, you got Blue Plate. Oh, I dropped them on pistachios on the floor there. Good thing they weren't open. Yeah. All right. They did okay. All right, got the Traeger Grill at $9.99. You like I said, what I'm thinking on the Traeger Grill. Let's see if I can find that photo. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Yeah, you can smoke some boudin on the Traeger Grill. Yeah, that comes out good. If you never ate smoked boudin, then you haven't lived before. <laughs> no, it's just rice dressing in a casing. That's all. West best foods. Yeah. In the West, yeah, on the West side, you got the best, you got best foods. And then on the East side, you got Hellman's. Yeah, Hellman's is a big deal. You know, like, but that's like a national, you know, that's like national brand. But so everybody's a lot, all different. Oh, it looks like I got to get Seahawks. It looks like Seahawks is going to add on, get added on to the list. Hey, I got the Intex pool. Hey, you know what? This Intex pool is big enough to put a few gators in. Yeah. Yeah. There's a few gators. That we could put, we could put them in the Intex pool while they're waiting to go to the moat. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Good. Thanks, Richard. Thanks for adding Seahawks. Uh, we got Seahawks at it. It looks like 27 minutes to go until we pick pick a seven dollar and seventy seven cent gift card. So we got the Intex pool. All I'm saying is it's 52 inches deep, and it's nice. So if you're a kid and you're seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, whatever, you don't you're not working. It's not like you got a job. Uh, and if it's hot outside, you wouldn't mind going swimming every day. That would be good. Hey, if it's not that one, it's the best way. Those are the two pools that do really, really well. If you want to go working out in the yard and go grow things, that wasn't exactly what I wanted to do. <laughs> yeah, I didn't do too good with the with the allergies and stuff, so I kind of stayed away from that. But it, but if you've got some flowers and trees and stuff you want to plant, you might need a gorilla cart. By the way, this gorilla cart can hold 1,200 pounds. That's a lot of fertilizer. By the way, fertilizer is going up like big time. Have you priced fertilizer yet? And by the way, have you bought eggs lately? Yeah. Anybody bought anybody bought eggs lately? Tell me what you paid for a dozen of eggs. What you, what did you pay for a dozen egg? Dozen large. What did you pay for a dozen large? Let me know. Let me know. A dozen. Because if the Easter Bunny buys the stuff before you do, you're in trouble. That stuff's going to be sky. I think it's going to be sky high. It's going to be sky high. I bought the last time I bought eggs, it was over seven bucks for three dozen at a club store, but it's going to go much higher than that. Yeah, you got the gorilla, got the gorilla carts. Hey, I tried the Sun Joe the other day. I don't have any foot, I don't have any video footage of it, but the Sun Joe, it worked out really good. I, I, I showed it 349. <laughs> Whoa, 349. That's a lot. You see what I'm saying? Three dozen, that's over 10 bucks. That's 10 bucks. 
Hey, by the way, five ninety, Jimmy, five ninety nine for a dozen. Five ninety nine. Wow. I want to have Rosina meatballs during the final four. There you go. So Rosalinda, got to put Rosalinda in there after Seahawks. Yeah, so it looks like we got Angelo, Allen, Tina, Candy Z, Evans, Jimmy, and Seahawks 15, 14. And now we got Rosalinda. Yeah. Anybody else buy eggs? Did you buy, buy your eggs before the Easter Bunny? Because once the Easter Bunny puts his order in, eggs are going to go even higher. But yeah, if you pay $5.99, where did you buy that from? That's up there. Um, I can I don't have the I don't have it in front of me, but if you sent it, uh uh if you sent it, I I I uh I should have no problem there. I'll check I'll check it um I'll check it soon. But I know as long as I know who you are, I don't I don't worry about getting a hold of somebody that I know that that's always on. Um, on Amazon Live, that's not what I'm worried about. I'm worried about a person that we that just started. We don't even, you know, it's the first time that we see somebody. Then we never know if we're going to see him again. But I have a feeling I'm always going to see Bernadine. Yeah, I'm always going to see. Okay, if somebody said, okay, do you think you could find Bernadine on Amazon Live in the next week? I'd say yes. What about Rosalinda? I'd say yes. What, what about Alan? Oh yeah, <laughs> it's not hard to find Alan. Now, Jimmy, uh, a little harder. Jimmy, a little harder. Uh, choosing happy? No problem. I'll find her within a very short period of time. Well, uh, let's see who else we got. Seahawks 15, 14? No problem. Richard? No problem. I mean, all these all these characters that are hanging out, it wouldn't take long to run them down on Amazon Live. It would be real easy. Real easy. So, like I said, if it's somebody we never heard of before and they just accidentally fell on Amazon Live and they're asking, like, what did I just get myself into? Because I'm sure people wonder all the time. There's people right now probably looking and saying, what is that guy talking about? I don't understand. What did I get on? Why is that guy got a bunch of stuff in back of his back of him? Oh, uh, let's see. Yeah, Alan is definitely. Yeah, it's, it's not hard to find Alan. You see, he's here. Right, he's here right now. You see, it's not hard to find Alan. So if Alan won and I didn't get his email address or something, like, oh, no problem. I'll find him. Yeah, I'll find them without a doubt. Hey, I got the works WG163. It's always 112.79. I don't know what the deal is, but somebody got a thing with 112.79 because it's been 112, 112.79 for like 90% of the time. It's always at 112.79. The lowest price I ever saw, saw it was $99. It doesn't really move too much, but it's a good weed eater. As long as you cut your grass and then weed eat it, every time you cut it, you should have no problem. Don't let it grow for six weeks and then try to edge it. That's a that's tough. That's tough for any other machines. Yeah, Black and Decker, like I said. Uh, yeah, Richard. Richard bought the Black and Decker just about I don't know about four or five days ago, and I think if I'm not mistaken, he got it for ninety five dollars. But since he bought it, it went down to ninety four. It went to ninety five. Went to ninety six, and then came back to ninety five. So it's been all over the place since he bought it. It just changes by a dollar. That's their. That's the way they price their stuff. They move it around a dollar. Now Yeti, they price. Their, they put a price on it and it just stays there. Yeah, Calvin got a. Calvin got a Reese's one. He didn't get. You know, he didn't get this from Amazon. He just got this from Reese's. <laughs> yeah, the guys from Hershey's hooked Calvin up with a with a nice with a nice uh, Yeti. It's nice, 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 nice. I like that. All right, I got the Elgato Stream Deck. One day I'll get it operating. I'll get I operated, but I I had I had problems with the computer, some conflicts, whatever. But I'll get that I'll get that straightened up. I can't wait to use it. I can't wait till I have some sound effects. That's gonna be pretty good. Nice, yeah, Evans. It's nice to have Reese's on it. Yeah, that's nice to have Reese's on it. Hey, the hat. Hey, by the way, it's nice to have a hat like this. This is that's pretty cool too. Yeah, I don't want to put it. I don't want to flip it up because all the names are gonna fall on the floor and then nobody's gonna win. We don't want that to happen. Yeah, the the Dell Inspiron. Once I figure it out, all I can say is that it's a beautiful computer. It's twenty seven inches. It it's fast. It's the fastest computer that I ever had. This thing rocks and. 
And I shouldn't say anything, but I haven't been hitting the brick wall lately. So at least maybe I maybe I figured figured it out. I don't know. I don't think uh, Faustino's. Not, I don't know if Faustino's in the prize thing. No, it's only it's seven dollars and seventy seven cents. We don't have. We got to put him. We got to put Faustino's service in when we have multiple prizes. So yeah, that's the. Yeah, or either that, or you got a seven dollar and seven. Seven dollar and seventy seven cent voucher for uh, help from Faustino. Very talented person. Very knowledgeable. Can help you. What he he could help you over the phone. Oh, you're too expensive. Seven seventy seven dollars. Uh, seven 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 dollars and seventy seven cents doesn't cover it. Yeah, I gotta wait for the big prize. I gotta wait. I I, I guess I can't get him in there until i get up to two thousand followers or something like that it's got to be for a it has oh uh, yeah i can only i can only afford seven dollars like i guess i was lucky the other day i had i had a valuable prize there and i and i i just didn't take advantage of it but i'll 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 get it again later down the road hey got the instant pot duo chris they got a six quart and eight quart check out both of them I have it on top of my head for a reason because everything I've ever sold goes in an Instapot and you could and you could cook it in there. And and that's why, you know, I talk about all these different things. Today I ate some, let's see, what did I eat today? I ate some Tyson chicken chunks. Yeah, you know, whole chicken. I'm not talking about no nuggets. I'm not talking about re-put together stuff. I'm not talking about no fake food or anything. I'm talking about a big chunk of chicken that's breaded from Tyson. That's what I ate today. And I ate some checker fries. I ate some checker fries earlier today. But just a while ago, I got to eat some jambalaya. Oh, that's it. I was saving up for a new computer. But next gift card, I will I will go straight to a box of Airheads and beef jerky. Yeah, I can't. That's two different things. But, I mean, both of those are really, really good. No doubt about that. Yeah, if you can't afford a computer, you can always get some uh, some beef jerky you can't afford it if you can't get to the if you don't have enough you know if you don't have enough of a gift card to buy that that new printer you could always get a you could always get a box of beef jerky or a bag of beef jerky hey look you got the nordic track here at 649 the nordic track 649 that's the number this one right here is the number one selling wait what time it is 18 minutes got 18 minutes left 18 minutes left the, the drawbridge is coming up Drawbridge is coming up real soon. Yep. The Gators are getting restless. They want to get out. Hey, look, the Nordic track is at number one on the top 100 treadmills, but it's the top selling item that I have this year. In 2022, the treadmill, the Nordic track treadmill at 649, it goes 10 miles an hour. It goes up 10% incline. And if you could run 10 miles an hour, uh, that's pretty good because most people can't. That's uh that's that's get that's booking. And then then the deal is if you add the 10%, that definitely slows you down for sure, for sure. Hey, I showed the greater goods nutrition scale a little earlier. Yeah, it was 47 now. Last week it was 39. That was a good price. If you ever get a chance to get it in the 30s, go for it because it doesn't spend much time in the 30s. It's in the 40s and the 50s. So if it gets in the 30s, I'd go ahead and get it. Very informative. It it's really really gives you really gives you a lot of information. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. And then guess what? Uh, who was it yesterday? Told me go ahead and see if you could clean the uh, the camera, like it had a fingerprint on it or something like that. And when I did that, you could see you could see the stuff behind me even better. Yeah. Let's see. I got to move this out the way. This light. This is my light. All right, it's gone. I should have done that a long time ago, but I didn't. All right, the lights, I, I got the light out the way. You don't know how tight it is in here. I got stuff on top of stuff on top of stuff. Oh. All right, got the fridge there. Did I make some ice? Yeah, I don't know if you can see the ice. Maybe you can see the ice now. All right, let me move this. Hold on. Let me get this out the way. Yeah, you might. Can you see the ice cubes? Is it clear? If you got it on the big screen, can you see ice cubes in there? I don't know if you can. It used to, you know, whatever I did, I don't know what I did, but I did something and you could actually, there's not as much glare as there was. There used to be tons of glare, but it looks like it reduced a little bit for some reason. All right, I got my little scoop. When you get your Frigidaire ice machine, 
comes in handy for like the final four or it comes in handy for like, uh, I don't know, uh, preseason football that starts real soon. All right. And it also comes in handy for the first, for the first Amazon Thursday night football game. That's going to start on September 8th. The Rams are going to be in there, but I don't know who they're playing. Can you believe it's going to be on Amazon? Thursday night football is going to be on Amazon. Oh, I can't wait to hear people talk about that. That's going to be funny. Remember when people used to say to NFL Network, How, I don't have that. How are we going to get that? And Well, now they're going to say, Amazon, I don't have Amazon. Well, I guess you're going to have to get it because if you want to see football, that's how it's going to happen. Yeah, Amazon's going to be in the football business real soon. September the 8th, first game. Getting ready for it. Going to talk about food all the way till then. Yeah, going to talk about all kinds of stuff, all the different things that you could eat on Thursday night football. Hey, you got the Blue Yeti here at $79. I bought it at $95 to $99 back in 2019 when I started live streaming on LinkedIn. Yeah, they let me in the door. I wasn't a live, you know, I wasn't a, you know, I didn't, I didn't do anything. I never did anything like this. All I did was sell stuff. I never did presentations and stuff. You know, I'm talking about to the computer. <laughs> I never did that. So I, so I applied for LinkedIn in the early days. You had to apply and then, and I got approved early in the game. And then I said, well, now what I'm going to do. And then that's when you learn all the things you got to do to be a live streamer. You got, you got to learn, you got to learn a few things. There's a learning curve, especially and then the older you are, the more of a learning curve you have because a lot of things you don't know about. Yeah, you find out real quick. Yeah, what is that? Discord? <laughs> What's that? Discord? I don't even know about that. Discord. What's Discord? I always hear y'all talking about Discord. Hey, Blue Yeti at 79. That's a good that's a good price. Hey, the Bose 700s. The, this is a good this is a good headphone. It it sounds great. It's, you know, it's perfect for me. I've been wearing it for like 5 months. The only thing is it finally went back to regular price. It was $329. It stayed at $379 forever. Forever. Never moved. And then it started to move. Like $25, $35. And then it went down $50 and stayed down at $50. Stayed down $50 bucks for a while. And then it finally went back to regular price. Hey, this Samsung's at $347. That's the best price I ever saw. The Samsung 43-inch. You can move it around. You don't have to have that big old TV. You don't have to have it. Yeah, you know how the thing goes. If you got a 55, 65, 75, 85, it's hard to move that thing around your house. You usually have one place for it, and that's it. But a 43, you can put it anywhere. You can put it anywhere. You can put it on your kitchen table if you want. And then you can put it back. You can put it back somewhere else later. But anyway, it's a great, it's a great TV. When you skip 10 yard, 10 yards, when you skip 10 years. On a new TV, boy, it's a big change when you buy that. Just like getting a vehicle. You get a vehicle and you buy a new one. Wow, you kidding? I can't believe all this stuff. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, my my, ve my vehicle is for, uh, 2008. Yeah, it's been around for a long time. Yeah, 2008. Yeah, so when I if I ever get a new vehicle, it's going to be a big change for me too. Yeah, that's a long time, right? 22, 2008, 14 years. That's a, that's a long time. Samsung 347. Hey, look, the Lucid. I bought the Lucid mattresses 10 years ago. I just found out a few months ago that's what I had. I didn't know. 10 years I've been having them. I've been having five mattresses, and they work out okay. So, you know, what can I say? They, they're working out okay. 10 years, five mattresses. I didn't have a problem with the first one, the second one, the third one, the fourth one, the fifth one. All five of them are working out okay. And I'm not looking at buying a new one. You don't hear me. Do you hear me say it? Oh, man, I got to buy a new mattress because my old one don't work too good. No, I'm not saying that. It's working out good. Working out good. Working out good. Let's see. Let's see. Hold on a second. Uh, I got to. I got to get this thing going. Let me make sure I didn't fall off. Let me see if my communication is still there. Hold on just one second. I will be back.
Okay, it looks like I was live. Yeah, look, I'm I tell you what, I'm I'm still live. How about that? I can't believe it. Still live, still haven't it's still working. How long? How much longer we got? Ten minutes. Ten minutes until we pull another name. Hey, the Honeywell yesterday was 110, and I said it. It was a great deal. So if you got it, great. If you didn't get it, well, it's back to 129. Last year, it was in the 130s and 140s, and a, a good price during the summer was 120-something. That was a good price, and that's what you got now, 129, but it was 110 yesterday. That was great. That was a great price other than Amazon Prime Day or early Black Friday Day or Black Friday. Yeah, all those days. Look, next year, later this year, when you start to shop, when you start getting things for the holidays, don't wait till Black Friday. You gotta, you gotta get going as soon as, as soon as Halloween rolls around. It's time. They got, they had some deals right around Halloween. Wow, it was rocking and rolling be way before Black Friday. So keep that in mind. Halloween is the new Black Friday, I think. Nespresso, this is at 262. That's the lowest price I've seen. At the beginning of the year, it was 319. Then it went to 299, then 289, then 279, then 268, and then 262. The lowest price I saw last year was 239. And that was one time. A one time. That's it. It was easy come, easy go, and it was gone. 262 is a good price if you're looking for one. And you know what else is a good price? That 309 price from Seagate. I've been watching that for like five months. That's the lowest price. 329 was the low. Well, 319 was it 319? No, it was 319 a while ago. 319. 319, 329. 329. I think it was 329. And then it went to 309. Yeah. It was 329. That was the low price. Now it's 309. So that's good. That's a good price. And it sells, it sells pretty well. It really does. 309 is a good price. That's where it's at. Hey, the sofa, the sofa love seat. Let's see. We got only nine minutes. The alligators are getting restless. They want to get out. We're saving them in that big Intex pool, but we're going to have to transfer them to the moat really soon. All right, let's see. I got the Lavoit. Hey, the Lavoit is down. The, the sofa love seat, that's at 269. That's like $20 higher than what it was last year. I think you you could call that inflation. Hey, the Lavoit is a dollar less than it was yesterday. It went down a dollar. Hey, look, it's got 55,975 reviews. That's a lot of reviews. And that's a low cost of entry. You can get into the air purification game. Without spending too much money. And if you like it, you can buy one for another room later. And if you got, yeah, Laurie B. Yeah, we're, we're into, yeah, we're into the next, next round. We got to add Laurie B. Is, did we not? Let's see. We're gonna, gonna have to see. Got to get Laurie B in the next go round. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna check that in just a second there. Da, da, da. We got the we got the gazebo here. The one thing that you want to, the one thing that's good is that all that bad weather that happened this week and last week that passed. Uh, hopefully that, that's it for the bad weather, but who knows? Maybe some more is coming. Anyway, this is two thousand nine hundred ninety nine dollars. Anything related to you know building stuff, it's high. It's much higher. Last year it stayed at twenty nine ninety nine pretty much. But this year it's up to $32.99. So it's kind of like it's on deal, but it's the it's it's like the same price it was last year. Yeah, got the Duramax at $13.99. That was the second best selling item I had last year. And I talk about a lot of stuff. And remember, this is I've been on 300 and, 330 days in a row. 300 and 330 days in a row. And I've been watching that for a long time. But the thing is, hey, that's number two. The Westinghouse generator is number one, but the this one is number two at thirteen ninety nine. It's got an eighteen horsepower motor. It's got electric start. It works with it works with gas. It works with propane. They call it the beast because it's it's big time. Yeah, yeah. So the uh, yeah, Richard says six minutes to the Gators. Yeah, the Gators will be released in six minutes. The Gators did did. Um, you know, did settle down during the game. But now that the game is over, they're out to get somebody, you know, a late arrival or something like that. 
Yeah. Hey, you got the Zenith mattresses. They did real well last year for me. And I'd still be really talking a lot about them, but I found out I got some lucid ones. <laughs> I got the lucid ones. Okay, so I'm a, I did so well. Joni Marie. Joni Marie is here. Yeah. Yeah, this that this place definitely gets you hungry. You wait. You think you're hungry now? Wait till I wait. Hopefully. Hopefully later down the road when I get when I get some stuff cooking on the grill. Yeah. Stuff cooking in the grill. Remember, I'm a professional heater upper, so I could heat things up on the grill. I can handle that. I can handle that. I don't think I have any gator, though. I don't have no gator, though. No. I got... I got to get some shrimp to put on the grill later down the road. I got to get some big ones to put on the grill. Yeah, I got to do that. Since I got a grill, right? <laughs> Since I got a grill, I got to do that. Yeah. I... I, I tend to like the smaller shrimp to put in the gumbos and the jambalayas and in the peel. And I, I don't have to have the monster shrimp. I rather, because you know, if it's the smaller ones, you get more of them. So you got, you got more shrimp. Yeah. You got Laurie. Yeah. That, that's, uh, that's unbelievable. That Lake Crusade. It's, it's got such a fan club. The people that actually buy that, they really love that. They love that thing. They're, there, when you say expensive, that you're really talking expensive. It's unbelievable. When I heard the price the, for the first time, I just couldn't believe it. And I know some expensive stuff because I know, you know, commercial cooking equipment's expensive. But I never would have believed that 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 thing behind these five hundred and something dollars, five hundred six hundred dollars. That's a big one. That's like thirteen. I think it's thirteen quarts. All right, we got, yeah, it looks like we're getting close. I, you know what? I better start writing names down because I don't have much time. And the Gators are going to be roaming the roaming the moat. All right, let's see. Let me get this. Let me get this going, get this going. All right, I got to get, oh, I got to get Angelo. Got Angelo. Got Alan. Alan's in the hat. Angelo's in the hat. Who else I got? Oh, Tink is holding the Gators back. Oh, yeah, they're definitely they're definitely hungry. Uh, we might need to throw them out. So, is there anybody? <laughs> Faustino, you don't want to go swimming, do you? <laughs> they're hungry. <laughs> yeah. Alan, Alan. Tina and Candy. Tina. Candy. All right, we got Candy. Evans. Evans, Jimmy, and Seahawks. Evans. Jimmy, Seahawks, Seahawks, and what else I got? Rosalinda and Joni, Rosalinda and Joni. You saw that? I was writing, and I wasn't even looking. How about that? All right, let's see. Do I have uh, Joni? Joni Marie is in. You in? No swim. Faustino does not swim. No. Nope. Gators are no gators. Yep. Joni Marie. All right. I think I don't think there's enough time for too much too many much of anybody else. I think I think that's about I think that's gonna be about it. Let's see. I, I'm gonna watch. I'm watching now. Oh an eel emoji. Not yet. You yes, you got me thank you okay got it got it dale dale dale's here my next stop <laughs> Joni marie let's see let's see it's getting close it's getting close it's only two minutes it's only one minute and 30 seconds i'm looking at, i'm 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 keeping an eye on the see any if anybody's slipping through at the last minute yeah because when that when the when the Gators get loose, that's it. It's only one minute, 60 seconds. In fact, let me. Hey, Siri, 60 seconds. One minute, counting down. All right, we're at 53 seconds there. 50. All right, let me see. Let me check. Let me check my Amazon thing here. See who's, if anybody's. Uh, trying to get in here. Joni Marie's already accepted. Tina's already accepted. We don't have any late. We don't have. Oh, there's only 30 seconds left. That's it. 
30 seconds. 30 seconds. Thirty seconds. Oh, less than that now. Well, that's fifteen seconds according to my phone. Only twelve seconds according to my phone. I think that's it. I think that's it. Five seconds. All right. Oh man, man, those gators got the jump. The gators didn't even wait till the thing went click click and the stop signs out. That's it. It's over. It's over. It's over. It's over. Gators, any any turtles? Did the turtles get out yet? Did the turtles? Oh, David, too. I'm gonna put. <laughs> yeah. All right. Let's see. Yeah, it's 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 over. It's over. All right. It's time to cut. It's time to cut. Time to cut. Time to cut up the names. All right. If you were in the first one, you're already you're still you know you're still in there from a while ago. So we don't have to put you back in there because you're already in there. All right, let's see, let's see, let's see. Where's my looking for my scissors? Oh man, where'd it go? Okay, I got it. I got the scissors. All right, getting ready to cut it up. No, the gator, it's too late. It's too late now. The gators are gone. Yeah, it's time. Yep, that's it. All right, Angelo is in. Alan is in. Tina is in. All right, got a few more. That's it. Candy Z. We got Evans. I got Jimmy. I got Seahawks. I got Rosalinda. And I got Joni Marie. All right, that's it. That's it. That's it. That's it. That's it. All right, then the hat. Let me let me go ahead and mix them up. Got it. My cat is stalking me. He wants to crawl in my. Ah. Okay. Let's see. Let me get back to the real time here. All right. I'm not looking at the comments right now, but I got to mix this all up. Got to get this all. Got to get this going. Mixing it all up. Nobody has fallen out of the hat yet. Nobody. I usually I usually see the people that fall out the hat all out the hat. Okay, I think I got it mixed up pretty good. I think I got it mixed up pretty good. So I'm gonna go ahead and jump in there and see. Oh, okay. I think I could. I'm gonna jump into real time. Let me get into real time. No, I'm not in the real time. I just want to see the comments coming through. All right. So I think I got I got one. And like I always say, I hope they're here right now. Hopefully, hopefully they're not. Hopefully they didn't go out somewhere else and go miss it. All right. I'm looking down. And it's face down. And I'm flipping it over. And it. Wow. I can't I can't believe this. I think this is crazy, but it's screaming for ice cream. But I think that I think she said she was going to bed. So I gotta put it <laughs> she's been went how how in the world she winning so much? Wow. Let's see. Let me hey Siri, 30 seconds. 30 seconds starting now. She may wake up. Yeah, <laughs> she may wake up. Oh, you're here? Oh, okay. No, 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 no. If you're here, you're here. No, oh, no, no. You you won again. So I mean that that's hey, uh you're you're just you're just extremely lucky. Yeah. You sure? You sure you want to do that? You sure you want to do that? Okay, all right. I'm just saying you're per, you're pretty lucky, I gotta tell you. Wow. That's pretty good. All right, so screaming, screaming for ice cream has uh, has decided that she wants to go ahead and let somebody else win. Since since she's like on fire, <laughs> yeah, she's doing good. All right, well, thank you, appreciate that, appreciate that. That's good, that's good. So somebody else got a chance. You see, not everybody does that, okay? And that's pretty 
That's pretty neat. Pretty neat. Pretty neat. Pretty neat. That's uh doesn't happen too often. So, all right, I got one. I got one. Yeah, I thought I thought you said that you went to bed. Oh, okay, you're close. Okay. <laughs> all right. Well, thanks a lot. Thanks a lot. All right. Let's see what this one is. All right. I'm looking, looking. And it is. Uh, it ends with an O. It's Angelo. Angelo. Angelo is the winner. Angelo. Angelo. I think Angelo won a long time ago. I, I think, I think, I think. Okay. Oh, God, I guess I got to. I guess I gotta put the, I gotta put the uh, thirty second timer on Angelo. Hey, uh, oh well, I don't even have to do that. Angelo's here. Okay, Angelo, uh, I'm gonna put the address up. Let me put the address up. Congratulations, Angelo. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. All right. Dun, dun, dun. Angelo. Angelo. Let's see. Got to find, got to find the address. There we go. All right, I found it. Okay, so Angelo, just go ahead and send. Hey, you won the seven dollars and seventy-seven cents. Yeah, the seven dollars and seventy-seven cent prize, Angelo. And like I said, uh, screaming for ice cream. Thanks a lot. I appreciate that. Uh, that was real nice of you to forward it to another another winner. All right, seven seventy-seven. So now we got Angelo, Serene, a Bernadine, screaming for ice cream, and Alley Cat. Alley Cat. Alley Cat. All right, that's five. That's five. Huh, let's see. Should I? Uh, I think I think I I think I could I think I can make it to 12. I guess I I guess I can make it to 12. Look, we'll get to 12. We get to twelve, and I'll I'll do another. I'll do the seven seventy seven at twelve o'clock. Seven seventy seven at twelve o'clock. Let's see what happens. Let's see what happens. All right, I went. I made it through the carousel. I think. Let me just finish through the carousel. I'm gonna go jump into the. I guess the candy section, and see how how that goes. Okay, we got five winners tonight. We're looking for a number six at twelve o'clock. At twelve o'clock. At 12 o'clock Central, 1 o'clock Eastern. Yeah, that's where it is. That's what we're doing. Oh, by the way, I got up to, I got 1,133 followers. Hey, by the way, if you're, if you're, if for some reason you're on this stream and wondering what's going on. Yeah, we're, I'm giving out gift cards, Amazon gift cards at $7.77. And I'm doing it right on the hour, right on the hour. You know, Okay, so it's real easy. Everybody knows the characters that are hanging around my carousel. I mean, not my carousel, my live stream. They know when to let the gators go. Yeah, they don't They don't release them early. So it's okay to get across the bridge. But if you get across the bridge, that's okay. The drawbridge goes up and, you know. Yeah, so they're going to be released at 12 o'clock. Gators, gators, are, gators are put back in their pen. The gators are back. The gators are back. The drawbridge is coming back down. If it's, if we get a few extra, if we get a few extra to go across the bridge, you're going to be safe because the drawbridge is down and the gators are gone. And, uh, and the snapping turtles. Yeah, the snapping turtles have been put away and it's okay. All right, let's see. I'm going to uh, remember to, well, I'm just going to say this. Uh, I, it, this is a good question for you. It's National Peanut Butter Day. A National Peanut Butter and Jelly Sandwich Day. Tell me, what do you like? Which brand you like the best? Jif, uh, Skippy, 
you know, which one, which one? Tell me. There's a bunch of different peanut butter brands. Which one you like the best? Just let me know. I want to know which one you like the best. And if you like jelly or jam, tell me what it is. Is it Smuckers? Is it strawberry? Is it you tell me what it is? If you're making a sandwich with peanut butter and jelly, or whatever, just tell me what brand you buy. Yeah, tell me what brands that you do buy. Only uh, Serene G says uh only PB and Smuckers. Uh Tink says Skippy. Any GIFs in the house? What about GIF? GIF? Any GIFs in the house? GIF. Jeff or Skippy's in the house. Reese. Oh, Reese is good. Yeah, Reese is good. Yeah, as soon as you put Reese on a peanut butter thing, it doesn't matter who makes it. It makes it just makes it special. Uh Serene G's don't like jelly. I'm not a jelly, I'm not a jelly fan either. I, I ate peanut butter, peanut butter, peanut butter. Yeah, all the time. Smuckers strawberry preserve, low sugar. Smuckers. Hard to find. Yeah, that's why that's the thing with that's the thing with Amazon is that a lot of the things that are hard to find you could find on Amazon, you know, and then just like anything. Look, I after 45 years of living in a grocery store, I know pricing, okay? So some things on Amazon, they're it's priced right, but a lot of times it's on the higher side. So I mean, if I'm talking about something, if it's if it's priced right according to where you live and it's something priced right, then you get it. But I some things are, you know, it's a market. It's it's supply and demand. Sometimes there's an item that could be $5 in the store, but because it's not available where you get, where you live, and you end up buying it on Amazon, it could be $10. Well, I'm not talking about buying things that are priced like that, you know, unless you really, 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 really want it. But for the most part, there's, there's things that are priced Somebody do this for me. Somebody look this up for me. Look look this up and then tell me where you look where you're from and then I mean what state you're in. Tell me what it costs. Cause it looks it's pretty the cost over where I'm at is it's uh it, it's very, very, very affordable to get it on Amazon. Yeah, the price is right. I got the community coffee that I talked about all the time. It's priced right. What does it cost for a this is a 30 30 ounce jar? Of blue plate yeah look it up and see if you see what i see i don't know you could be in a different area it might be a different you know might be a different price or something see what it says anybody looking up blue plate blue plate look up blue plate and tell me yeah no you don't have no you definitely don't have it in your area no but what i mean is look it up look it up on amazon and see what it's see what it says if you're since you're in Washington, yeah, since you're in Washington, look it up there and see if the price that you get is different than what I would get, let's say. Because I'll look it up. Let's see. Uh let me look up blue plate. In fact, I'm gonna I'm gonna do something a little different. Uh, and hopefully this doesn't mess up my uh hopefully this doesn't mess up my uh my computer computer because i've been doing so good and not getting knocked off <laughs> let's see okay i'm going to show you this let's see share Okay, this is uh, this is my website. It's all geared to getting people on Amazon. All right, if you go to, if you hit that little thing on the top, the top purple bar, you go to Amazon. You go to where it says, go to our Amazon store. You go to Amazon. You hit this, uh, follow our Amazon lives. You go to Amazon. <laughs> if you if you click our picture, you go to Amazon. Okay, you, you get it. Everything's devoted to that. Now let's see. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go here. All right. So what I did was I put a bunch of items on my website, all about Amazon, right? I always talk about these protein bars here, and that's here. But you see, like the blue plate for me, it says 307. I want to know if it says 307 in your neck of the woods. Yeah. Does it say 307? See, that's priced right. That 
that's a very good price on Amazon. A real good price. Does that is that what it is that what you see? All right, let me go on over to here. I talk about the Instapot all the time, uh, but red beans are a big deal down here. And you know, I, I used to talk about it a lot, a lot, a lot. I don't talk about it as much anymore. But anyway, this is this is why we're excited. We we're excited about gumbo, jambalaya, and red beans and rice. Yeah, so that's a um, that's a big deal down here, big deal. Okay, so the red beans, you get the red beans, you get the Instapot on Amazon, and then here's the other one, the Blue Plate. This is what I was talking about, Blue Plate. Uh, all the different, all the different. Let's see, make sure I do this thing right. All the different. Uh, Pole boys that you would get in New Orleans. If you're visiting for the, let's say you were visiting for the final four that's going on right now and you're eating a pole boy somewhere, there's a good chance you might be eating a fried shrimp pole boy. And guess what? Mayo is on it. It's got to be blue plate. There's a good chance it's blue plate. Blue plate's the big deal down here. All right, here you go. You get the blue plate. You can get the blue plate on Amazon. And it's only, I see it when I'm looking at it, looking it up, it's only $3.07. That's pretty good for a 30 ounce jar. Did those shrimp look good? Here's the king cake. I've been talking about the king cake. This is a Randazzle king cake. Uh, the, the king cake that was available on Amazon during that promotion I did in February, that was Randazzle. Now, this was Manny Randazzle. The one that we were looking at was Nona Randazzle. It's the, the old family recipe. Here you got Zaps chips, the Zaps craw taters, the crawfish the potato chips that I'm always talking about. Yeah, this was on this was on the Food Network. Yeah. I'll just I'll just show just a little bit of it. Welcome back to Unwrap where we're taking a road trip down south and we have a little stop in Louisiana for a taste of Cajun flavor. They're called Zaps potato chips and they taste like they were born on the bayou. So, we're going to find out how they make these Cajun craw taters. One day, Louisiana native Ron Zappi tasted a kettle fried potato chip that knocked his socks off. They were crunchier and they were crisper and they were thicker and had some pretty intense spices on them. The five alarm flavor gave Ron an idea. He'd apply Louisiana's signature spices to a chip and export it to the public. We've always been great in our food. 
but I think that comes with a covenant. I think they expect things to be a little better down here if you're from Louisiana. In 1985, Ron began making chips with personalities as unique as his own. Well, our first two flavors was the jalapeno and regular. But... I just made it shorter. Uh, let's see. And this is the Elmer's Easter candy in Ponchatoula, Louisiana. Yeah, they make the they make the, the gold bricks, the pecan eggs, and the heavenly hash. And that's like I said, this particular plant makes the second the most chocolate heart uh Valentine candy. Yeah, they're the second in production on Valentine candy in the country. So they're major, major, major manufacturer. And you see that equipment right there, that ain't cheap. There's a lot of robotics in it. But anyway, here's a story. And it's, it's focused on Amazon again. Still on the hunt for Easter treats? You can try some from a family-owned and operated store that's 160 years old. Elmer Chocolate is known for its gold brick eggs, heavenly hash eggs, and pecan eggs. It's also the second largest manufacturer of heart-shaped box candy in North America. The Louisiana store was the first to sell candy, its gold brick egg for 10 cents in 1936. Now at the time, candy was only going for a nickel and people didn't think it would sell. But the chocolate's the hit and now people order it from all over for Easter with their family. And if you're wondering whether you can get this heavenly hash by in time for Easter, we went to the magic box. We did. <laughs> and looked it up and, and, and they sell it through Amazon. So that means that, that you can order it this morning and there'll be somebody knocking on their drone, knocking yeah, on your the drone. drone. <laughs> Drop it on your porch tomorrow. No, but, yeah, very much so. Yeah, so anyway, that was pretty cool. That was pretty cool. That's um that they actually said you get it on Amazon. Yeah. Hey, and if you don't think we eat a lot of seafood down here, check this out. Yeah, so anyway, that's that's that. Let me um let me jump back here. Yeah, let me jump <laughs> let me jump back to the front here. I'll come back, I'll come back to that in a second. I saw that I saw that I got some answers to the stuff. Okay, Dale, let's see. Wait, 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 let's see. It, it started coming in after I, I after I turned away. Here we go. Let's see. Um 30 ounce jar, 307 tink. Okay, so that's yeah. So the deal is if you want, if you like may mayonnaise, if you like mayonnaise and you want something different, this is a real, this is a real oh, popular one down in my neck of the woods. It it used to be made in New Orleans. It goes way back. Okay. And it it's it's you know, they've competed in a lot of national contests and it's done pretty well. Of course, you know, Hellman's and Best is, you know, the one that does does the majority of business. But if you if you like mayo and you want something a little different for three dollars and seven cents, you can't beat it. The price is right, three oh seven. And then Richard says three thirty six. Uh, yeah, that's you see what I'm saying. <laughs> yeah, three thirty six. So, so I'm telling you, I know that's a very good price. Dale's got three oh seven Minnesota. Yeah, Richard's got two ninety two. Okay, so I'm just saying that's a great price. Hey. Uh, Call that geeks in here. Yeah, I'm sorry it took seven minutes to get back with you, but I was kind of going through my, going through a little bit of the stuff that I have on uh, some videos from some of the, you know, products from down here. Yeah, so I didn't see. Uh, yeah, so, okay, so that's what I'm saying, that mayo is a great price. Okay, what is reserve sausage? Reserve. I'm not sure on that one. Reserve. Reserve, reserve. I don't, I don't. 
Tina, it is sauce that is left over from Nightmare. Oh, okay, okay. I got you. Okay. The side till end. I don't even think I had dinner. Yeah, a lot of yeah, this if you hadn't had dinner, this is probably not the this is probably not the the uh the, the live stream that you want to hang out in. Yeah, because it definitely definitely makes you hungry. There's one, there's one thing I, I gotta show. I'm gonna go back to this. It's uh it's the one on uh on the crawfish bread. The New Orleans Jazz and Heritage Festival got canceled the last couple of years. It's a big deal because musicians from all over the world come in for this thing. Because, you know, New Orleans is kind of known for music, you know, kind of, kind of. Yeah, for music and food. And it's a big event. In fact, the Rolling Stones were coming. And unfortunately, didn't happen. It got canceled again. But anyway, this year, this year is another year. And it's supposed to be a big, gigantic event in April. And they make crawfish bread. And that's a big deal. So Blue Plate put together this uh, crawfish bread deal. So watch it. Watch it. I think the production's pretty good. I think so. Let's see. Let's get to it. The crawfish bread. Let me find it. Let me find it. The crawfish bread. The crawfish bread. Let me get down to it. Cafe de Mon. You got Tabasco. You get Cafe de Mon stuff on Amazon. You get Tabasco on Amazon. You can get... Chef Paul Prudhomme seasoning on Amazon. And last but not least, here's that blue plate mayo again. And no, this is crawfish bread. Big popular. It's a popular item down here, especially during the New Orleans Jazz and Heritage Festival. If you get a chance, you ought to check out to see who's going to be at the New Orleans Jazz and Heritage Festival this year. You, you're not going to believe it. It, it. It's a who's who in the music business. Yeah, I think that I think they did a good job on that video. I think that was pretty cool. Yeah, definitely positively. All right, let me see. I'm coming back, coming back over here, coming back. I'm seeing if I can make it. I gotta make it to uh, twelve o'clock. Got thirty three minutes before we put the drawbridge up and let the gators go. Gators are gonna be loose soon, 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 soon. Yeah, if you're wondering if that was good. I can answer that for you. Yeah, it was good. Of course it was good. In fact, I got to eat crawfish tonight. I got to eat some, I got to eat jambalaya that had crawfish, some Louisiana crawfish tail meat, and some shrimp in it, and some sausage. And I got to eat that tonight. I didn't know what was, I didn't know what was going on in the kitchen, but that's what was going on. Got to eat, didn't expect to eat crawfish tonight, but I did. So that's, but I, but basically with all the food I've seen and, in my career, I can tell you that people go crazy over that, which you just saw. And then, like I said, the music, uh, the, the the fact that they found that good music to go with it. Hey, look, I'm going to jump into the, the, the top, the best selling stuff on Amazon. I got to get over. Oh, I got to change. I got to stop. Got to stop and go on to another screen. Let me change my screen here. Uh, I'll get to it. I'll find it. Hey, hey, what happened to my screen there? Did I lose it? No, I found it. All right, let me share this. I'm going to going to the bestseller section. Uh, they got 40 different departments, and I always like to go to the food section where the where the stuff for the humans live. Yeah. If you're a human and you like food, this is where all the food's at. All the other categories, the 39 other categories, they don't have human food in it. All right, I'm going to jump on over to snacks and sweets. Snacks and sweets. And I think, let's see, I got a half an hour. 
Uh, let's see. I guess I could go into candy and chocolate. Let me go into candy and chocolate. Yeah, I'm going into candy and chocolate. I'm going to check it out. Let's see. Hey, got the ring pops. Let's see before I get started here. Yeah, I got I only got I only got 30 minutes. I better hurry up before the alligators get loose. I'm going to have to do this quick. I'm going to have to do this quick. All right, got everything in the carousel. Got that all done. Uh, like I said, I don't think that Intex uh, kayak is going to make it through the moat. Okay, so if you plan on being late, uh, you might not get there. Yeah, alligators love love uh, kayaks, especially inflatable ones, <laughs> especially if there's something in it for them. Hey, you got the ring pop at number one. A lot of kids love that stuff. A lot, a lot of hey, anybody got kids that eat that stuff? Yeah, I think you, I think if you got kids, I don't know if <laughs> I don't know if there's much ring pops eating at work when you when you're working. At a place like a factory, I don't know if there's many adults eating ring pops. I don't know. I don't. I guess not. I don't think so. Maybe there is, but I think it's all kids. Hey, you got the pure 100% xylitol chewing gum. First time I tasted something that was made in, with xylitol. Man, I thought that was good. Somebody sent me something about this uh, made with this sweeter sweetener called xylitol. I was crazy about it, but the thing is, back in those days, I did frozen foods. I didn't do. I didn't do candy. I wasn't a candy. I wasn't a candy guy at that time when I got the samples. But I said, "Wow, this xylitol is pretty good." The sweetener, you know. Hey, got Airheads at number three. Hey, when they say the Airheads are, are popular, they weren't kidding. Look, I got that ninety count back there. Yeah, that ninety count is back there. That's a lot of. That's a lot of. That's a lot of sugar. That stuff's good though. Yeah, it's definitely good. It's been around for a long time. I think it said five flavors and a mystery. I'm back. I'm back, man. I tell you what, I was doing so good. I haven't frozen like, uh, like I don't know, like eight or nine, like eight hours or so. So I was so, I was so happy. I thought I was doing good, but apparently my frozen, my, I still, still having some problems. But at least they're not as bad as they were because it were bad. All right, the gator wall. Yeah, the gator wall is down. Yep, the the gators are getting ready to go. This has got 27 minutes left to go. Yeah, okay, let me get back to where I was. Let me get back where I was. I was dealing with the candy. It's the Gators didn't like the candy talk, I guess. I guess. The, uh, look, the Gators don't want no <laughs> the Gators don't want no airheads, I don't think. I guess that's what they were worried about. But anyway, you got yeah, you got a bunch you got a few flavors and a mystery flavor. Where does it say? It says that somewhere. Uh hey, and the good thing about it is it doesn't have the allergens. You see, free of the big eight allergens, milk. Eggs, peanuts, tree nuts, soy, fish, shellfish, and wheat. Yeah. One thing if you're in the if you're in the food business, you better make sure you don't have no allergens on in your product. And if you do, it better be on that label. And if it's not, boy, that you got a problem. Yeah, because you got to recall it. That's not a good thing. Hey, got an Easter bunny basket here at number four. 
You got the Bazooka Candy brand Easter candy at number five. You see a lot of this stuff. It's going to be disappearing. It's not going to be here long. If you're going to buy it, you got to buy it soon. You got Black Forest Juicy Burst at number six. You got the mints. Hey, Lifesaver mints. Which one you like, the green bag or the blue bag? I like the green bag. Yeah, I like the green bag at number seven. That's what I like. Jolly Rancher at number eight. You got, you know, this is going to be gone soon because we don't need no snowman. <laughs> the snowman. <laughs> Is going to be gone soon. Yeah, at number nine. Hey, you got the extra gum at number 10. Okay, we got 10 down. got 90 to go. Uh, but I only got 25 minutes before the gators get loose. All right, you got the extra gum at number 10. 10, 10, 10. All right, we got that. Tootsie Rolls. Tootsie Roll Easter eggs. Well, that's there now. It's in. It's almost in the top 10. You got Twizzlers at number 12. Hey, if you, if you eat the red licorice, you know the red ones, do you eat the black ones? You... Do you eat the red and the black, or do you eat just the black or just the red? Let me know. Let me know when it comes to licorice. Hey, you got the extra at number 13. Extras at 14. You got the Yum Earth at 15. You got the Mentos at number 16. That's the ones that are great. Yeah, I like great. But when it comes to Mentos, I don't care what color it is. I, I eat them all. And I, I think this is an item that a lot of people don't know about, this Haribo berries here i think they did a great job with this check this out this is cool i mean look how nice that's nice and look you get and as far as kids are concerned they like it because that's a five pound bag that's a lot of berries that's a lot of berries check this out check this out isn't that nice that would be good for easter that's a good that's a good little deal for easter if you're creative and you can come up with some you know some ways to put the berries you can i bet I bet you there's a lot of kids that never get berries picked for by the Easter Bunny, but here's some berries that would work. That's just that's just an idea. But anyway, you got you're gonna you're gonna end up with five pounds of berries. Boy, the kids will definitely love you for that. Twenty dollars, twenty dollars for a five pound bag. Let's see what the ratings are. Four point six. You see, so it looks good, tastes good. All right, that's at number what? Number what? Let's see. Uh, that's at number 17. You got Yum Earth Organic Pops at number 18. You got the Push Pop from Giant at 19. You got the Red Vines. There's the red ones again. You got red ones here. You got the Twizzlers red, and then you got the Red Vines red at 20. You got Gin Gins at 21. There's those Ring Pops coming back again at number 22. You got Orbit. Orbit has been around forever at 23. Oh, speaking about forever, what about Brock's? Brock's has been here forever. That's man, that goes way back when. At number 24, you got the high key caramel clusters. This is the keto blend. I'm not looking for keto, but if it's got caramel and it's got chocolate, I'm in. I haven't tried it yet, but uh, it's on my it's on it, I guess it would be on my list in the candy business. Hey, you got Zolly Pops at 26. This is this candy's supposed to be good for you supposed to be a lot better for your teeth it reduces your your trips to the dentist oh it looks like i see st looks like st we could add st to the oh wow a 1400 coffee machine watch out watch out yeah st we could add st into the we can put ST in, in the list. Yeah, put him on the list. He could be in the third round. Blue, brown, looks good. Don't like the organic pops. Have them. Ah, yeah. Well, I'm not. Hey, look, when you start getting to that healthy, healthy candy, uh, so, you know, it just depends. Some people could, you know, some people could handle the healthier candy and some people can't. Yeah, let's see. Yeah, let's see. I can't think of Jolly Ranch. Well, my teeth feeling like they're stuck together. Yeah, watch out for the Jolly Ranchers. Watch out, watch out, watch out. Yeah, that's been around. I remember when I I remember when I started school, Jolly Ranchers were five cents. When I was in the first grade, Jolly Ranchers were were in the machine at five cents. It was a Jolly Rancher stick. You know, Jolly Rancher stick stick. But they had the Boston baked beans and the lemon heads and the uh let's see they had the jawbreakers uh they had the 
Yeah, Red Hots, Lemon Heads. Yeah, all kinds of candy. Five cents a piece. That's what it was. Solid Pops is good stuff. You got the Peeps at 27. You got the Ice Cubes at 28. You got the Brock's Jelly Beans at 29. Yeah, Brock's goes way back, I got to tell you. Hey, look, Mentos. Mentos at 30. 30 down, 70 to go. Let's see, Gator. Yeah, 21 minutes to Gator time. I got to get rolling. I can't be late. I got to be responsible. Because we can't let the gators go and then have the drawbridge down because somebody might, yeah, we might have an accident there. We don't need no accident. Hey, you got the Dove Chocolate at 31. You got Haribo Gold Bears at 32. Altoids at 33. And look, you got Jolly Ranchers. You got the Jolly Ranchers fruit flavored gummies. That's interesting. That's a five pound bag. That's a lot. Yeah, that's a lot of, that's a lot of product there at 34. But, I, but you know what I'm talking about. Those berries look pretty cool as far as Easter baskets are concerned. Hey, at 35, you got Bonnie and Pop. This did real well for me last year. It was a top five item, top five food item for me. Yeah, Bonnie and Pop. They make some fancy stuff that tastes good. Yeah, let's check. Let's check out Bonnie and Pop. By the way, the guitar, the good, I like the guitar part on the second video. Got two videos back to back. Here we go. Bonnie and Pop. <laughs> So you got the guitar part there. That was good. Good stuff. Did well. Did well in 2021. Expect a good year from it in 2022. You got the extra gum with the watermelon flavor at 36. You got the giggles from Yum Earth at 37. You got Starburst Skittles. Can't go wrong there. That's two big powerful brands at 38. Got extra gum at 39. Tic Tacs at 40. Tic Tacs been around for a while. They go back a long way. 40. 40 down. 60 to go. Let's see. 